be named. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, everyone. We're back with uh, not the normal video, especially for a stream, but we're here today with Tuna. What's up, Tuna? I, I was thinking of a joke. I don't have anything. Hey, what's up? <laughs> so I he thought... is going mm -hmm. to play. So actually, what, can you explain to us what we're doing? Um, we're playing demo this. Um, this is a lot more formal than I thought. <laughs> You're being a lot more formal than I thought. <laughs> oh, yeah. Than I thought when I uh, pitched the idea. I guess, uh, yeah. Are you going to make this into a video or no? Just stream? Nah. Okay. Yeah. You know, I, yeah. I to... <laughs> I'll, yeah. I'll do an intro in a second. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. No, you're all good. So, yeah, we're, we're, we're pretty much going to be just playing demo discs. Hi, Jay Hank. Hey, Mike. What's up? Yes, demo disc nostalgia. Yeah, Tuna and I are going to play all the demo discs for the PS2 over the next, you know, however long it takes. It should be about one a stream. And if we have a long time, two. We probably do two. I don't know if he wants to. But oh, yeah. <laughs> it's possible. Yeah. It's so, fun. yeah, what's up? What's up, extremists? What's up? So... I we're gonna take turns. One person's gonna play the demo disc, and the other one's going to. Uh, is it commentate and direct, or what exactly am I doing? Yeah, um, commentate. I'm, the only thing I'm doing is like you know going through and then actually playing the games. I guess when they come up, and then next time we'll swap. Um, I feel like that's the easiest way to do this. Yeah, yeah. So I'm just gonna break him for playing badly. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna play fine, and then uh, yeah, we'll just we'll just talk about the demo discs and what's going on. This one is PlayStation Magazine number forty nine, and has uh, oh I had it up right here. Um, it actually has a few d good demos on it. Um, we got like Cool Borders, uh, Ico. Oh, you're um I, 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 yeah, uh, spoil. <laughs> oh, it's it. I was gonna have it be, I was gonna have it be like a surprise when we go through. <laughs> oh crap! <laughs> it's okay. I, I, yeah, is that okay? Do you? I thought that'd be more fun to be like. No, oh. that's fine. That's fine. Yeah. Well, you sent me that thing, and I looked, and I, now I already know all the games. <laughs> it, oh, that's okay. I guess I meant like more for the audience. Oh, to, for the audience. I to, see. Uh, to be honest, I don't know. I know there's um, there's the games we obviously saw, but there's like there's a, there's quite a bit. Um, so I don't know everything. In this yeah. Thing. I just glanced at it, but um. There, there, is, there are quite a few games. I was surprised at how many games there were. Okay, that might could be good or bad, but. Uh, no, no, in a good way. In a good way, for sure. Uh, let's see here. My, all right, I'm recording on my end. Um, Matthew Goji Berry, what's up, guys? And Tuna, Tuna's here watching himself play. I am. Um, oh, this is difficult because I wanted to do like a, a tiny short intro, like you just did. But um, when you when you do the demo disc, an FMB starts playing immediately and doesn't give you like any time to. Oh yeah yeah yeah. Do you want to reset and then just let it go? Uh you sure. could probably just go up to system and restart, and it might come up. You are very right. Well, I'm thinking about in the video. They probably you probably need an, an intro of some kind, right? <laughs> oh, in mine? Oh, I'm not no, worried. You you do whatever you my... need to do. We're we're good. Oh, now I'm all no. Nah, yeah, I don't have anything scripted, Joe. You're good at this. I'm not. <laughs> do, you, do hey, how about this? How about you rest? How, uh, do you want me to do something? <laughs> <laughs> no, no. Hey guys, today we're taking a look at uh, PlayStation demo discs. Uh, this is the first demo disc. I'm joined by Joe. We're doing an intro again, I guess. And uh, I'm going to reset it and we'll go from there and we'll see how it works. <laughs> yeah, this is going to be great. We're going to play all the PS2 demo discs. Yeah, and one. we're going to take turns. One commentating, one playing. And it'll be a good time. We'll We'll see what cool things are contained in each of the discs. So it looks like there's a lot more than just games. Hey, gang. Uh, oh, this is a lot. Wow. I don't know about this angle, Joe. <laughs> it's, really, it, it's, it's a little quiet. I can fix that. I don't know if you have. Better? It is a little better. Uh, more? Yeah, a little more. Can you turn me up on Discord? Uh, oh, oh, uh, I bet I can. 
So our programmers are using a new 360 degree If you turn up my uh, voice thing. A company called Enrel. From the time you enter the E3 hall Got it. and you reach the Sony booth, you can actually get a quick How's it sound, show chat? Floor. Here is how it works. Once I take off out of here, you can use the analog sticks to pan the camera left or right so you can virtually look around. I figured you'd Better. sneak that word in there somewhere. Question mark? Once inside, yeah. the Sony booth will transform into a cool heads-up display where you can check out some of the games and videos in different areas. And what about the Ooh. stories? I'm getting to that! When you're inside the booth, you can also check out the segments <laughs> we shot while in Japan. Oh, it was the Dark Cloud it wasn't the 90s. It was the 2000s. And We're sassy. The Tokyo Game Show. Oh, we have, yeah. right we have toed. However, rather than showing you the games that will someday end up on the shelves here in the U.S., we thought we'd give you a look at some of the stranger titles. And downloads? <laughs> there and there. Just look for the icon on the menu display. Well, it sounds to me like you've got this issue wrapped up, but aren't you afraid that the 360-degree camera will show your bad side? What bad side? Oh, oh no! Oh my God! <laughs> okay, uh, so is okay. So we we got it sounding better. Yep. Uh, no, no, we're gonna do all all the demo discs that I think that are available. Astro, what's up? Good. Okay, I'm I'm good. Yeah, I'm glad everyone can see now. Oh so no! This is it's looping. Am I looping? What's going on? I don't know. Joe, hold me. I'm trying. Can can you control this in any way? Oh my god, I can. <gasps> this is what she was saying. Oh no. Holy crap. There's no one here. E3 really is dead. Oh, it is. Oh, yeah. poor E3. There's Titus. That's how you pronounce that, right? It, it's it's Teet Us. Okay. Teet Titus. What, what bad side Z snap formation? Yeah, yeah, that's exactly what she did. Oh my god, I can control. This is nuts. I'm actually yeah. really impressed. This is what, what is this, 2000 and what? Uh, one. I mean, this would be the first. This would be the first with E3 with PlayStation 2, wasn't it? Uh, maybe it was. I, I'm, I'm looking at the issue and seeing if there's a, a date. Uh, yeah, 2001, October 2001. And the PS2 released in, no, it released in 2000, I thought, right? Am I correct? Yeah, yeah, but so it, probably about a year. Okay. But then it would have been its first, like, E3 being, being uh, alive. Yeah. Like, uh, um, okay, we got Maximo. We got Jack yeah. Rector. We got Okage. Oh, it ended. Oh, no. Uh, accessing the PlayStation booth. I'm hacking. I'm getting in. He's getting in, guys. Look at his, his, his hacker speed. Yes. All right, yeah. Let's take a look at the first PlayStation 2 demo disc from the official PlayStation magazine. It's kind of strange because this was... Um, this was PlayStation Underground. This was that transitionary period, I guess, when they went from PlayStation Underground, which was mostly a PlayStation thing, I remember getting. And then I guess it just switched to the official PlayStation magazine over time, slowly. Good deal. I mean, they were ha they were happy with if Sony was doing so well. Yep, we got uh, Vault, which is games, Download Cafe, which is cheats, I assume. Press room, which uh, sounds boring. E3 roundup sounds boring as well. Oh, no, that'll be um, videos, I'm assuming. Oh, yeah, of, of that current E3, yeah. Uh, bulletins, which sounds super exciting. I love bulletin boards. Yeah. Uh, oh, Tokyo Station. Okay. You got the, yep. Yeah, that doesn't sound scary. Uh, <laughs> broadband. Uh, we got a map with, oh, we got New Zealand is on this map. You can see it. Oh, they're so nice to include New Zealand. E3 booth, and yeah, um, I guess we should just go through. Where do you want to start first? I. Yeah. Um. Why don't we should do? Uh, 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 just go to E3 Roundup and see what's available to look at. I think you, we we don't necessarily have to watch any, but if we wanted to at least see what games were coming out. Yeah. See, there we go. So they have Jack and Daxter, Kinetica, Metal Gear Solid 2. So these are the videos that they were playing for uh, some of these Kinetica. I'm just oh, gonna oh, hit. It's... I just hit the first one. Oh, it's country time, I guess. Okay. Country was big in 2001. Very big. This isn't country. Well, this is it's more like this is an alternate rock type. Some kind. That man is very Master, tired. The precursor <laughs> legacy. Was created with the original team that did Crash Bandicoot, and it's our first project on the PlayStation 2. 
and this game is something that we're really excited about. It was developed for a year and a half. It's a non-linear gameplay. Did you ever you play Jack and Dexter? I have not. And as you go forward, yeah, you see that there's a very involved story. <laughs> I don't know, keep we saying. We were a, a uh, Ratchet and Clank uh, household. And mystery um, that has I have both right now, but shots fired, everyone. Shots fired. Of this universe. Nobody really knows why it's there, but Narmi Comfort food in Jack, video game form. Ah, that sounds good. Controls, is special enough to be able to unlock these mysteries. I feel bad for this guy because he's you can tell he's tired and he gave this presentation like 20 times so he's just very monotone and robotic when giving out the info yeah I mean yeah he's that event is just like constant that time Jack and Dexter is our new game we're very excited about it it comes out and you can it's non-linear and you can go on the two sides it's a lot of fun action <laughs> trying to scream over the how loud the floor is oh uh, yeah Oh, I remember Kinetica. I I, I want to play it because it's an interesting looking racing game. Platinum for the first is super easy, but I can't say the same for Richard Fogel. Uh, the game that we're looking at here is Kinetica. It's a fast action racing game. It takes place in the future. Focus on this new style of racing where the bikes have been combined with the humans in this sort of an armored suit where the wheels are yes. so that they're right in there with the speed. And Seems dangerous. Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm a little worried. The sense of speed seriously doesn't look the greatest. <laughs> no, it doesn't. Like, the tricks look cool, but the sense of speed seems slow on the slow side. Yeah, and we had, like, wipeout and stuff, right? I mean, yeah. This seems like, like extra speed would be more beneficial. The, the characters are really detailed. I bet. I wonder if that's why. I wonder if it can be Oh, maybe. Needs. Maybe. I love this. Yeah, that's cool. He's probably tired from having to socialize for 30 hours in a 24 hour period. <laughs> Just add those six extra hours to Each of is great. I've been meaning to do a video on Draken. Oh, yeah. Someone told me about uh, our recommended she can engage in hand -to -hand um, combat. It's interesting. It's weird. Using the magic system. And then the coolest part is that you can get on Aeroch, who is your dragon counterpart, and fly around, take to the skies, and engage in intense aerial combat. He has a great Dude, this looks dynamic. great for the PS2. Uh, Jesus. a lot of time tuning the flight control, so it's very fluid, and you really feel like you're in flight, but it's yet still very easy to control. And one of the coolest things about the PlayStation 2 is it allows us to render these enormous landscapes. Uh, we're nothing in them. <laughs> begin the game after <laughs> Dragon 1 ended. <laughs> Your brothers died. You're burying the village. Yeah, but it, you know, it makes you feel like it's there. Yeah, I mean, at the time. <laughs> yeah, yeah, at the time, it's like, oh my god, you can actually make someone feel like that. I feel like I'm Draken. Check out Draken Fall 2001. You can't quite count the pixels anymore. Not like you could that long before that. This game does look very slow. Yeah, it does. So sad. Matthew wants to total overdose. Is a, uh, oh, so calm. Military action game that we're developing for the PlayStation 2. It's a team-based game. So in yeah. both single-player and multiplayer, the object game of is to use spiritual your prequel. teammates in order to accomplish the mission objectives. Another one that features that we're really excited about with SOCOM is the online capabilities. SOCOM is going to be one of the first games released this fall that supports the Sony oh, yes. analog. I believe it was adapter. SOCOM and Tony Hawk uh, Pro Skater 4. They had, I think it was 4 that were one of the first multiplayer. I think Tony Hawk was one of the first, if not the first. Oh. That makes sense. Them and capture what it's like to be a US Navy SEAL. We were also able to go out SOCOM to the range 2. Oh, I'll do SOCOM. I have a couple of SOCOMs. Guns. So when you play the game, you're really going to get a feel for the realism and authenticity. You really feel like you're SOCOM. SOCOM US Navy SEALs will be available <laughs> this fall exclusively for the PlayStation 2. This is, a, this is a bit much. This is long. Yeah, wow. Uh, what else we got? Frequency? Did you say frequency? Yeah, I played Amplitude, oh, not frequency. Sorry, I think they're pretty much the same game. Oh, okay. I did a video uh, featuring Okage. Yes, you did. Yeah, it was with uh, it was the. Uh... <sighs> what was the video that you did? It was this the Halloween one? Was it? Yes. Did you play Okage? Not yet. I have not. No, you 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 uh, recommended it, and I said yes, I do need to play it, so I need to find it. Yeah, it's it's, it's weird. Yeah, it looks weird. Attacks, then an enemy attacks. Basically, 
look, look, look at that uh, UI. That UI looks like look, that UI looks like an idle clicker game. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> like it looks like uh, uh, not Clicker Heroes. What's what's the other big one that everyone plays? Uh, not Mel, not Melvior, but uh, Cookie Clicker. Uh, uh, Cookie Clicker is there too. There's a more recent one that uh, uh, not everyone likes. That it's like just menus. It's just menus on menus. It looks just like that. <laughs> is an online DJing game that allows you to oh, yes, build yeah. a song with friends and existing tunes. Frequency was cool. These are, um, this was before Rock Band, yeah, uh, same tunnel, developer. Side of the tunnel represents a different oh, instrument. okay, so they were really... Oh, uh, yeah, it was the same developer as Rock Band, right? Because Guitar Hero was Activision. Uh, yeah, I think so. And this is Harmonix. Uh, oh, oh, right, right, right. yeah. I'm pretty sure. People. I could be wrong. Yeah, uh, Frequency was cool. There's Frequency and Amplitude. Frequency was the first game, Amplitude was like the sequel, but they're pretty much the same game. Um, as you go through, each track is a instrument, so if you, if you, like, succeed on a track, that instrument will kick in, in the music. Oh. So you'd have these, um, you'd have these well-known songs, but then like only the guitar and drums would play. And then, you know, if you did good, then everything would play. But sometimes it'd just be vocals and drum, drums. So it, okay. it was really cool. It was really weird. It is so cool. And it's a third-person action Pro Skater 3 was the first. Oh, Mike's saying Pro Skater 3 was the first. Adventure Gabbos. Yeah, Okage does seem pretty good. Guitaru Man! Yeah, bring back rhythm games. This game offers new gameplay, first time ever seen on uh, actually any type of game. You're actually leading a girl all the way through the game. And there's a lot of puzzle elements. Oh, I love uh, escort quests. Well. Yeah, I know, right? Make a game out of it. Yes, thank you. The reflections look nice. Yeah, yeah. All the in-game cutscenes is all real time. There's no TV. Is this game? Is this game made because no one here has gotten the full hands of the girl? We're like we we made a game where we fulfilled our <laughs> race desire, no, holding hands of the girl longer than. An the, four, the four equal fans are gonna be very upset when they hear that. Yeah. <laughs> oh no, five minutes ten. I know Dirk, but yeah, sorry. We're uh, we're we're, we're looking at demo stuff today. How's the quality? Oh, we be fun. How's the quality on your end, by the way? Everything looked good? Uh, yeah. Yeah, looks great. Nice. My $10 is going to work. <laughs> $10! I bought Discord Nitro so that the screen quality would be better. <laughs> kind of on accident. He didn't actually mean to. He was trying to test it out first just to see some things, and then he clicked on it, and it just, boom. Yeah. And now I got Nitro. I'm going to spam emotes at you later to make up for it. There oh, yeah, you get your $10 worth. Yeah, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So this is, um, four? Pro skater? Yeah. Momentum, the guy that remains standing. But you run into somebody else in the middle of a, of a huge trick string, you can wipe their whole oh, score pot clean. That's right. You added that bonus into your combo. Totally oh, yeah. Um, so there's tons of different parts. You can scale your yeah, in multiplayer, if you're doing it, I think if your combo is higher than the other person on multiplayer and you run into each other, then the person with a higher combo went like smacks the other one basically oh nice yeah this <laughs> mike says that stash yeah yeah that guy's mustache is glorious he looks like a guy who is working on making a pro skater game <laughs> wow i'm ben brinkman with ea sports big nba street is three on this video is really long first one to 21. <laughs> yeah man they've got so many games yeah I didn't play NBA Street, but I did play a ton of NFL Street 2. Oh, okay. Ooh, that is not a good-looking character model. Uh-uh. There's no fouls. How do you win? <laughs> no, I, 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 I'm sure it's just chaos. No rules. I brought a knife. <laughs> Feels like that might be. <laughs> this does feel like the logical, uh, you know, like NBA Jam. I remember playing NBA Jam a lot. I don't know if you ever played it. No, I kind of feel like I missed out because it looks fun. It, it was pretty cool. I liked. I, I remember. I remember having. You know, it was like two player teams, and you. Uh, I mean, it was a, it 
there's like two players, you run and you just dunk. You just dunk as many times as you can. You get on fire after doing it so many times. And then you're like faster, you can jump higher, you can do like, I'm pretty sure you can do a half court um, a slam dunk. Gotcha, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's definitely over the top. Like, uh, uh, oh, Ace Combat. Yeah. I think most users will find it easy to get into the game, unlike most sim games. So it's not as difficult as a sim, and yet the realism factor is very high. We've actually Ace Combat is a really fun game. Like if you have friends, you can probably play this game, not like those nerds with their flight setups. <laughs> yeah. You guys suck, am I right? Oh man, this is really unprofessional. Ace Combat 4 will be Yeah! I've played every Ace Combat game. And they're all bangers. Pretty much. And I won't be convinced otherwise. I... Speaking oh, of bangers. Capcom Entertainment, we are today yeah, yeah, there we go. Uh, Devil May Cry, the brand new gothic thriller from a Gothic comic thriller, that's how I describe Devil May Cry. Yep. This was, um, this was before they really knew what Devil May Cry was gonna be. <laughs> it was an accident, yeah. Oh, crap. John, just check in because I'm going to bed. Just want to say hi. Oh, yeah. Everyone say hi to John. John. Hello, John. We're looking at some demo discs tonight. Stunning graphics, it all comes together just for an incredible game experience. I think he's a fan of Devil May Cry. He's, a, he's the number one hype man. So look for it then, it's gonna be a great release. Uh, that was, uh, yeah, I mean, Devil May Cry was originally gonna be Resident Evil game, and then it became this weird... Yeah, yeah, they were gonna make, it was gonna be Resident Evil 4, but it... Yeah, oh, your favorite game. What? <laughs> what? Oh, okay, no. I don't remember seeing this. You did a video on her, Gary. You played it. I mean, you're the in, in the in the section. Yeah. I didn't realize it was I was on this disc. Got some interla nice interlacing going on. Yeah, it's it's crazy. I like I barely ever see anything about Hurdy Gurdy, and then suddenly it's a big as E3 video. You are the number. Yeah, you're the. Four, oh, well, uh, what's the term? You're the expert on Hurdy Gurdy. You're probably the most knowledgeable of any person online <laughs> yeah oh oh i have to tell you something about it in a minute uh, i don't want to take over silent hills uh. okay, okay, yeah, yeah. i'll remind you it should be totally different from silent hill this time you know silent hill is no longer just game this is uh i think more than a novel and a movie this time the you know main hero came back to uh silent hill because uh his dead wife <laughs> he came back to Silent Hill because his dead wife. No, his English is surprisingly good, um, but it's it, it's interesting having um, someone who actually worked on the game and a Japanese studio come over to you know America's E3 and then try to sell it yeah. there at the at their big booth. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. Very thick accent. Um, no, his accent is actually very uh, thin compared to the people I uh, run into regularly. <laughs> Try to speak English. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. You, I was gonna say you. Uh, that, that. You live there, you'd know probably. Hi, my name yeah, that guy has one of the better Konami. English We're accents. Booth, Metal Gear Solid. <laughs> Metal Gear Solid. I've never heard of this one. And it's better no, than this, ever. What is this? The graphics are insane. Yes. The realism is incredible. The company must so be many like indie. Yeah, Snake this doesn't look very do good. Uh, okay, is that is it a one? Everyone is just yeah, this, awed by this. He has like a mullet. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. It absolutely ruins the game. Yeah. The now nah, she didn't. This looks dumb. Much stronger and more oh, she has armpit hair. So Everyone. <laughs> This is clearly going to Finally, the game for me. Metal Gear Solid experience to a whole new level. So gamers, we have <laughs> I could give Metal Gear Solid, Solid 2 Sons of Liberty on the PlayStation 2. This is going to be the hottest oh, worst game graphics this I've ever seen. No this guy's getting too intense for me. Yeah, yeah, he is very happy about Metal Gear Solid. He was gesturing at me in a threatening manner. <laughs> This video is ridiculously long. 
they're really making use of that DVD functionality. Yeah. Okay. There we go. Yeah. There's E3 roundup. Oh yeah, that makes sense. There we go. Yeah. Um, oh, was that all these videos put together? I bet that's yeah. What it was. Yeah, it was. It was. So yeah. we. Yeah, there's quite a few in here. I'm gonna. I'm gonna just. I'm gonna triple check, but I'm positive. Yeah. This is the same. Yeah. It's literally just the sections put together in a full video. Ah, uh, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Well. Okay. That, yeah. Those. That those that's fun. Um, all right, well, what, what's in the uh, what's the actual games that are available on this? Um, I was all go, those games. I think ah, uh, I don't know. I was just gonna go through like linear style. Uh, oh sure, no, that's fine. That's okay. So we so I don't miss anything. There are so many. Five point one hidden codes. Turn your TV to channel three. Um, we got Rayman in the oh, vault. Yeah. Press R two and circle. What is that? In the vault. Oh, in the um, the vault is the demos. Okay. Oh, so Rayman 2, Smuggler's Run, EA Sports Big, SSX, and Silent Scope. Um, chat, can you remember this? <laughs> yeah, everyone take a mental picture. Take a men mental picture. All right, they got it. Threads. Oh, we can order some some clothes. We got Ape, es Ape Escape, represent. Yeah, oh, ordering information. What? Oh, press square. Can we? To order. Call. To order. Oh. oh. Joe. Joe, you know what you need to do. I don't have my phone on me. Uh, oh, I would. Oh, Joe. <laughs> Joe. Uh, interesting. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll order us some Ape Escape t-shirts. <laughs> yeah, there's only a... Uh, yeah, you can pay an extra 10 bucks to get a rush charge to get it uh, shipped immediately. Ooh, within 24 hours. Ooh, uh, oh. That shipping is kind of expensive. $7? Should be a so, yeah. They don't, they don't take up that much space. I think that was when like shipping was such a big deal. Oh, you're probably now right. It feels like this was yeah, before, it's like rolled into the items. This was before Amazon even. So yeah. Uh huh. Uh, Amazon wasn't even selling books yet. Not quite. Nope. Or I think I uh Amazon started in the 90s. Am I crazy? I don't know. Oh yeah. oh, Valerie, did you call? Charges. Nice, Valerie. C can you call? Use my phone. Call it. Call that number. <laughs> call it. We dare you. It was just a. Oh, it was just a busy tone. She said it was just a busy tone. No. Okay. Ah, lame. I can't get my ape escape. Do it. T. Or as everyone uh, calls it, A E one. Ooh, A E one. We got a. Oh. We got a bucket hat. Wow. I'm gonna be real. That's a. That's kind of a crappy. It doesn't like. Oh. Yeah. It's just, it's just like they slapped a monkey on it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It, like, they, they, they literally could have made it shaped like the helmet on the monkey's head. True. True. Or like at least like make it yellow. Or like... <laughs> yeah, like, more like the colors of the game. Or just have like have like the emblem without the monkey. Or to have it... I don't know. Like do something... I don't know. It's just... I'm not feeling it. Yeah, it's like jean... Yeah. Jeans on your head. Denim? Anyway. Yeah, de <laughs> denim? Yeah, it's <laughs> denim. Yeah, I'm wearing my pants on my head. With a monkey on it. Oh, nice hat. You, you know, that's you're really crafty. Oh, no, no, I didn't make it myself. That's what it looked like. It looked like someone made it. <laughs> NFL game day. Yeah, this was before EA took over everything sports. Yeah, Amazon was selling books and, 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 and selling books then. I, I, I know they were selling books then. <laughs> oh, were they? Oh, interesting. Late 90s. Yeah, yeah. Mike was making fun of me. Yeah. Call him. Get him, Michael. Get him. Get him. Gran Turismo 2 hooded fleece sweatshirt. Oh, that's a good. That's a good price. That's not too bad. Thirty-seven ninety-five. Yeah, yeah. They're, they're about fifty bucks now. Like right, like for a branded one. Yeah. It's not a. I do like the um. I like the GR logo. I think that's nice. It's like subtle. Yeah. You can like scream, gamer. I guess. <laughs> you can wear that and it'll help. <laughs> this watch though, I'm not. This looks like something I got out of a cereal box. Yeah. Ooh, it has a yeah. it, it has time functions. <laughs> and time functions with wow. Okay. Yeah, I like this. That's a good design. I would get rid of the text, just have the GR. Oh yeah, there you go. I, I think the gray is a little boring. True. Gotta... Oh, hold on. What's up? It's yeah, really... him... he's all ready for bed. It's really cheap for a messenger bag. 30 bucks. Okay, yeah, that, that's fine. Everything but his yeah. Oh, this is. I need all the GT merch. Yeah, this isn't so bad. <laughs> no stoner outfit is complete without the ape escape bucket hat. 
I don't I don't want right. to I don't want clothing that says grind session on it. I'm good. <laughs> Baseball tee. All right, I'm kind of skipping through. We got a oh, golf towel. Let's go two. Oh, golf balls. Really? Ooh, no. Ooh, no. Take it from me. Yeah, I don't like the bad early 90s CGI, Laura. Uh, <laughs> how we doing, Earth King? We are looking at some demo discs today. Having a good time just checking them out. Coach is I, I I love the uh, the Laura. Laura well, Lara. the uh, the, the little zoom in. Yeah, yeah like so it you, comes we, out. It's like it's so small in the actual jacket that you need. That that looks too formal of a jacket to wear. That that just looks right yeah, as yeah. a collar. Yeah, I'm not I'm not digging the Laura stuff. Oh my god, they got a <laughs> they got a uh, <laughs> they got a pillow. Uh, they got a body pillow of Laura. I know it's a beach towel, but that's not how I'm gonna use it. You could you could wrap it and, and sew it up to be. Able to, it's you good. Wrap it around a towel. Uh, pillow. It's good they have it in towel form to clean up the mess. You can just yeah. You can just make the mess right on it. Uh, <laughs> right need, on her linen glasses. <laughs> I need that beach towel. <laughs> got it. Oh hey, what? Yes. Pull the number again. <laughs> Call the number. <laughs> he needs the Legend of Dragoon T. Oh my god, you're saying it like you don't know anything about Legend of Dragoon. Do you I not know anything about Legend of Dragoon? I do not know anything about Legend of Dragoon. It's a JRPG. It's a kind of a cult hit. Yeah. I know the characters have like weird designs. They look like robot bug people. Uh, a little bit, yeah. Well, they're dragons. Oh, they're dragoons. No, I, I thought they were bugs. No, they're dragons. What's it? What's a dragoon? Is that like a dragoon versus a dragon? Is that like wyvern versus a dragon? Uh, no. I I think it literally means the the fusion of them with a the, uh, human. Like it's a dragon, but you are a dragoon. <laughs> <That doesn't, laughs> I think uh, dragoon like human. Yeah, you, you, like you were like, a human, and now you're a dragoon. Dragoon, dragoon, like he, he, I, I'm trying to, it's not working, the phonics. Uh, I know, I know. You can get it, but you yeah. can get a $13 notebook. Oh, that's a, a pad folio. What's a pad folio? The leftover GT merch. Yeah, yeah, I know, because some of their watches, some of their GT merch. I don't know. I don't know what a pad folio is. Omega Boost. Omega. I just did a video on that. Oh, that's kind of a cute. Yeah, you got the logo on the back. That's kind of cute. Yeah, I love that one. Oh, you see, this is what I mean. Ape Escape. This is what you need to be doing. Something like that. Yeah, this is simple. You're right. You're right. Look at this. Parappa. Yeah. Good job. It's not just the character. Oh, we got a place in the backpack. I, I, I would like to get bullied. Get me one of those. <laughs> no, this isn't. I have a PlayStation uh, hoodie. I mean, I would want one. I that was yeah, just... I'm very cool with it when I wear it. Uh, yeah, there you go. There you go. All right, we got more bucket hats. It's khaki bucket hat. <laughs> yeah. Well, <laughs> well, that's the show. <laughs> you got the cargo they, they shorts. They came as pants. They came as pants. And they cut them off and they made that. <laughs> <laughs> Speaking of cool, cargo cargo shorts. Yep, yep. Got to carry all your games in the in the pocket. <laughs> all right, this is a lot. Sunglass shorts, case. Yeah. A sunglass case. All right, I'm just kind of going faster now. So the pouches, messenger bag. Oh, that's kind of cute. Yeah, that's. I like that. I like that. Yeah, I like that too. Yeah, basic. CD. It, that's Ooh. something you sit on the and the couch and just your underwear and the PlayStation. Long sleeve <laughs> shirt. <laughs> Travel. I, I like the case. I like the case. Yeah. How much does it hold? Twenty. It's okay. Siphon filter. If Ooh, it, 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 it haunts that. me. That's it haunts you. Get rid of the two, and get rid of the text at the top. Oh, okay. Just get rid of everything. Have a black. PlayStation cargo shorts, iconic. Ooh, Earth King has one exactly like those khaki pants. His Earth King are very cool. But do you have a Tomba Two lunchbox, Earth King? Aluminum. It's, aluminum. It's aluminum. Metal. It's beautiful. Which is good because you're gonna need it to use as a weapon when people wanna. When the bullies want to kick your ass for having a Toma 2 lunchbox. Toma 2, save me. Oh, God, the text is so blurry. It's so pixelated. Yeah. 
Slap the PS2 logo on them and you can make some money. Yeah. Man, they are really hawking merch. There's so much in here. A spiral messenger bag. Oh yeah, tiny tank. Like a, is this like a, a, a it's like a pocket watch. Is, <coughs> is it really? No, but it's basically. <laughs> what are we, hobbits? <laughs> Pull a pocket watch out, look at them. My, my, look at the time. Gotta get back <laughs> home for 11 C's. Okay, that's everything. Okay. All right, guys, give this number a call. Where yeah. else do they advertise this? Well, so like this stuff is probably advertised in E3. I guess they would probably advertise them at the back of instruction of manuals. Um, like if you open it up, like the very back of it, the last oh, couple right. pages or the very back. Yeah, I bet it comes in like a little card. Like you open the thing, you got the manual, and then you also got like a card, register your game, and then another one is probably. Yeah, whatever. yeah, you can like mail it in and it, yeah, yeah, mail in, yep. Ooh, we got a- oh, second dinner. We got um, people emailing. Placing underground. The Speak your mind. This sucks. Give me more Laura. Bro. <laughs> I am new to PlayStation and have a PlayStation 2. I also have some games like Frogger and Pac-Man that are PlayStation games, not PS2. I can't get them to save on the memory card for PS2. Any help? <laughs> Joe, what's the what's the answer? The answer is, we can help you here. All you need is a PlayStation memory card for the PlayStation formatted software. This will work with your PlayStation 2 computer entertainment system. The PlayStation 2 memory card only works with PlayStation 2 formatted software. Good luck. He definitely could have just said, it, the PlayStation 2 memory card only works for PlayStation 2 games. Gotta get a PlayStation. Where's my but Frogger? He... <laughs> I want to play Pac-Man. Stupid Frogger. game, I can't play Pac-Man. Look at this dude playing Frogger and Pac-Man in, in 2000. Get this man a, I know. Get this man a modern, some modern games. On his PS2, no doubt. He he bought a PS2 to play Frogger and Pac-Man. Uh, I will say, I do have fond memories of Frogger on the PlayStation 1 or 2. I can't remember. There was a, there was a decent Frogger game on it. <laughs> uh, was it like the adventure one or? Uh, it might. You you do do the tile jumping. And I thought, it, I thought it was like a platformer puzzle game. I don't remember. Oh, okay. I remember liking I... it. I don't remember anything about it. <laughs> <laughs> Let's we'll see. We'll have to look. I wish my memory card would work on the Atari Lynx. Nothing works on the Atari Lynx. No, just email. I still have, email I still have boxes for my Atari Lynx games. Oh, no. Email Sony and ask, why doesn't this work on my Lynx? What games work with the iLink cable? I know Unreal Tournament, but is that it? iLink cable. What is the Apparently, cable? you can challenge your friends and their PlayStation 2 computer entertainment systems on Unreal Tournament, Armored Core 2, and Silent Scope. Look out for tribes as well as other games coming soon. Check back, check the back of the game packaging to find out if they're compatible. <laughs> if all else fails, just buy it. <laughs> just try it out. What is um, iLink cable? I think that's like a system link. Um, I thought so, right? Yeah, yeah, you can connect the the systems together and then you yeah. can, it's like Halo on the Xbox. I did that a ton with um, Command & Conquer on the PlayStation, original PlayStation. And that was really cool really? because Command & Conquer, I played with my dad and brother, and you could, um, you could, uh, the game already came with two discs, and so if you bought the game once, you could system link it, because it came with two discs. I think, um, one was, like, one campaign, the other was the other campaign, and so you didn't oh, need to but... buy two copies of the game, which was, it was awesome. Oh, that is great. Oh, that's so smart yeah. of them to do, to, like... Yeah, yeah, it was so cool. That is, well, that's awesome. And we had, like, a friend, we would, like, yeah, he would come over and borrow, and we'd, we'd so cool. Place Growing up, I had most of the Pizza Hut demo discs. I'd love to get those again. Ah, oh, Praetorian! Playing Tenchu right now? Such a good game. Tenchu is a good game. Nice. Straight uh, out of Napoleon Dynamite. Where's my back, man? Where's my Frogger? No, will, play, will PlayStation Japan import games work on the, on the U.S. systems? <gasps> yes, they will. Now in this day and age, you can yeah. hack your PS2. We finally figured out that... Uh, for no reason, soft lo or region locking consoles makes no sense. Sorry, if you are lucky enough to score some cool Japanese imports, you'll also have to track down a Japanese PlayStation unit. You can really tell that, um, I feel like HR wrote these. It's so, like, oh, corporate. Yeah. Unfortunately, I agree. the US and European systems aren't compatible with our Eastern Friends games. Hey, they use the friends. Yeah, they use the, the possessive ap apostrophe there correctly oh they did yeah and they capitalize eastern because it's a because it's a 
pr proper noun? I don't remember. This is definitely HR. <laughs> it's corporate something wrote, wrote this. Corporate. I am new to PlayStation. Oh, nope, nope. Right there. Yeah. that was it. <laughs> they had they had like four fake questions. Yeah, yeah. I don't. I wonder if these are. I wonder if these are real. You think these are real? What, chat. What do you think? Did, Ooh, there you they, go. did they make these up, or do you think someone actually wrote in? Uh, I don't have any Pizza Hut. Uh, I have some demo discs, but I don't think they're Pizza Hut demo discs. Uh, well, you know what? I have a PlayStation one. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what I have. <laughs> next transmission is that the next demo, or is that the next um magazine edition? Hot Shots Golf Three. What does it take to proclaim? Uh, boring corporate speak. Yeah, this is just ads. Oh. Credits. Oh. Andrew House is the only name I recognize. Is he still? Uh, is he still Sony? I don't know. Oh, I wonder if he's moved. Sony did him wrong. Did him wrong. wrong. Oh, Chris well, at least they were they able to put the credits. Yeah, tip team. Ooh. Ray Batista. I loved him in Guardians of the Galaxy. <laughs> no, don't laugh at that. David Hayes. David Hayes is the Metal Gear guy, right? Is it really? Yeah. No, I'm just... It's David. <laughs> what is his name? David Hayter. I'm making a David Hayes. Oh, I see. I see. Okay. Right, yeah. uh, Maggie Intro Animation, produced and created by Secret Weapon. Guys, is Secret Weapon still in business? I'm is it really? This. I'm asking chat. Probably not. We'll have to hope they are because their animations were beautiful. Yeah, very, yeah. Was it the woman at the beginning? Is that their animation? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> we paid our uh, am animators uh, some leftover tacos from Taco Bell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't look at the five print. Never look at it. Too late. <laughs> okay, if your power cord catches on fire, we are not responsible for any death or dismemberment that may be caused by your PlayStation 2 system. <laughs> <laughs> if you play the you came at me with a knife <laughs> it kept playing fr it kept telling me not to play frogger anymore i just want to play my frogger game <laughs> fix my playstation uh... 2 i want to play frogger hidden codes we already did this okay um yep that is everything in this section Tokyo Polish station dude this is ridiculously full of things yeah is this Oh, oh, this is a bit much. We're going, we're going across, across the pond. I think that's you. Oh, is this? Yeah, <laughs> not there, not there. It's like I'm actually there. I can see. Yeah, smell. why is the music this? This <laughs> <laughs> calm. I think they made my uh, air, my air conditioner. Well, here we are at the Tokyo Game Show, E3's Japanese cousin. Now, we could have shown you all the oh, big the games. Oh, the Tokyo Game Show's E3, still going. We E3's dead, though. But... Yeah, E3's dead. Hey, Sla uh, 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 what's his name from Monster Rage? <laughs> I, I forget his name. It's, it's SL <laughs> something. Slimer? Are extremely <sighs> no, not Slimer. Babes. They also have a great sense of fashion. Yeah. Swayzo? Swayzo. Swayzo? That's a terrible monster rancher right. name. Not to hey, Zoomy Zorark! This is Demo Discs. Uh, this is a demo disc from uh, PlayStation Magazine, the first one from it isn't just an for PS2. It's a dramatic hero adventure game. You have all these conversations with the heroine and other characters. You I love conversations. Ah, yeah. So it's not your typical hero thing. You battle using conversation, and there isn't a single scene of violence. <laughs> There's no violence! <laughs> This game is well, boring as shit, everyone. <laughs> Zorark, I'm doing okay. I'm doing, thank you. That's very kind of you. I, I, I am, I'm doing well. We're, uh, two, I'm here with Tuna, who hey. is um, the other, uh, one of the other PS2 challengers, although lately he's been doing siphon filters. Stuff. Like carrots, you don't serve that although it's on PS2. So. And you serve all the guests with grilled meat when it's properly done. That raises their degree of satisfaction, and you complete the game. Ooh, I love what? <laughs> raising, raising degrees well, of satisfaction. If you're indulging in that game, you'll probably need this one. 
This is a diet simulation machine. You run by operating the special controller and the calories oh, appear wow. here. So in this game, one candy is one kilocalorie, and you can see how many kilocalories you've used up over the distance you've run so far. Burning kilocalories. <laughs> Scream. You want to hear the most annoying sound in the world? Yeah, this guy. This is one of our mini games. I went to this booth and the guy just started screaming at me. Into this mic. <laughs> You're digging deeper and deeper. If you don't make it to the catch your breath level before you run out of air in your lungs, it's game over. We have 15 oh, no. types of mini games like what? this. You use the mic so anybody can play easily. We hope you like it. That actually sounds like a great party game. I'm not gonna lie. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, I, I I'm trying to. I was trying to figure out what exactly it was. Okay, so it's not your typical game. Oh, the stand. It's, oh, it's Warrior Wear Inc. <laughs> the camera was tilting. <laughs> I need to get a shot. I need to, I need to get a shot. I need to get a good shot of the girls. Horse racing game. Uh, the only way they'll, they'll watch it. Yeah. Yeah. This, this is for me. Horse racing games where you raise racing horses. Oh god. Here are the ideas if you go to any like arcade in Japan, they, have, they always have these big setups the of the horse racing gambling games. Really? What the? What? It's surprisingly popular. Go into the final corner. Wow. The final corner. PS2 hype videos. Make that final spurt. Now they're on the final stretch. Spurt. They're using their whip. To make that final spurt, is what he said? Oh my god. If you do it right, you can take first place. Is this what this is? Uh, yeah, these are pretty much just, uh, pretty cool. like, this is E3 type Before you get that stuff. die game to your girlfriend. <laughs> I want to lose weight for my girlfriend. Uh, I need okay, a there we go. I need a booth, babe, girlfriend. That's why I came to Tokyo Game Show. Uh, yeah. <laughs> The girls are interested in me. They're, they treat me nice. That means they're. You know, that's true. If a girl is nice to you, that means she's interested. That's a pro, that's a pro tip. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. The, the, the second she even looks in your direction, yep. interest. You can start thinking about your future life together. <laughs> Broadband. We, we want everyone to know this is sarcasm. That is a joke. Do not. Yeah. Show the, ca Angeles. the cafe <laughs> lady is not interested in you. <laughs> Sony announced what a new Sam. technology that will expand its power. <laughs> Soon you'll be able to connect your PlayStation 2 to the internet, surf the web, and play online against opponents all around the world. I love and surfing the, the internet hyperspeed highway. What's it called? America Online teamed up to bring internet uh, America Online. Sorry. America Online. Yeah. Used yeah. yeah. to have those 100 free minutes. So Hell yeah. So oh yeah. Oh, this is a really corporate corporate man. Oh, this is an AOL guy. That's why. Dude, look at the look at the um old internet. Yeah. Yes. Celebrity number four revealed. Your buddy list. Your instant messaging. How happy he is. He's so happy using AOL. So how will you connect to the internet? I used to new That's crazy. They made a. Adapter, which will be available this they November. made a real internet based on the movie. You got mail. That's crazy. For people who use a yeah. Connection, as well as Tom Hanks is really. Uh, was it Tom Hanks? I don't remember. Like he's uh, yeah. This he's very. Uh, oh, there he is. Influential. A small price to pay for all the um, it, it, PS2 had internet. I don't know about Wi-Fi. I think there may have been one device that tried to do wireless, but I doubt it. Oh, that it would have been later. Yeah, that must have been terrible. Yeah. Have the ability to bring I, I, it's pretty much only Ethernet. Matthew says, December 2023, the 20th anniversary of Zuma Deluxe. Oh, by the studio who made Plans for Zombies. Internet to the PlayStation 2 will open up a world of possibilities. And in the next few years, the PlayStation 2 Online, even more. it really didn't. For instance, I think it was a failure, <laughs> to be honest. Yeah, especially over here, it just, there was like almost no, um, like I didn't even know it could for the longest time. Time, so uh, until my magazines were like talking about online games, I'm like, oh, yeah. I've never even seen anything in stores around me. It's just like no yeah. advertising there. I um, I had it. I played it regularly. I still have vivid memories of playing it. Um, I had this tiny CRT thing, and I used to play SOCOM. But that's the thing is, like, there was only a couple games that really had communities. It was like SOCOM, yeah. Pro Skater, um, Twisted Metal Black, and that was kind of it. You know, there's the kind of fantasy, I guess. I didn't know anyone who played that though. Uh, oh yeah, eleven.
But yeah, if you had like online for PlayStation 2, it wasn't like today, you know, you have online, you play all these different games. Like if you have Xbox Live, you know, you play all the different online games. PS2, you just kind of like, at least in my experience, you just played like the one online game. Like I just played SoCom yeah, online. There, I, there, there was really only one or two that you would play because it was it was tough to play. Yes, yeah. Zorak, I'm playing. I'm talking with uh, I'm talking with Tuna, and he does uh, PS2 stuff as well. Hey, Zorak. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I do more. Yeah, I do kind of adjacent combat uh, content, very similar to Joe, but kind of not in a weird way. Yeah, he has uh, he has uh, some some lists and um, what what is this? Uh, E3 booth. Next video. Sorry. Oh, okay. Hey, Zorak. Tuna. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I was gonna say yeah. You're you're on the you're both on the the Discord, so. Oh, they're making the the booth stuff, I guess. Oh uh, yeah. It seems like a lot of work for a thing that's only up for three days. Yeah, seriously. Damn. Ooh, this fish islands. This is extreme. <laughs> this is the, the style of the time. Yo, you guys want to see Can't a quick flip? <laughs> hey, so, Tuna, why are you the fish? Uh, blub blub? I'm a fish? Oh, um... <laughs> I snuck in. I don't know. <laughs> what is... Oh, oh that's the uh, Vegas E3 thing. That's a Vegas sphere. I've seen that on, uh, on the news. <laughs> All right. <laughs> that's... That's yeah. it? That's then the vault. Did we do and then we didn't do download cafe. We did not. Nope. Alright, so sorry, we'll do that first before I guess we'll save the game for last. Hey, look at that. Ooh, you can the off-road fury. One extra bike. One extra bike? Oh. Okay, I'm downloading it. Oh, oh right, right, yeah. Okay. So you actually get Panda Bear Kashmas unlocked? Oh. Panda Bear costume. I already got it. Surfing. Now, All characters and boards unlocked. This game, I think, sucks. If you want a surfing game, you get Trans World Surf on the PS2. Now, that's a, that's the best surfing game ever made. Fair enough. Fair enough. So, Trans World Surf is really cool because um, you're just at the beach and you can like find the different waves come in. You don't like you don't. It doesn't put you on the wave automatically. You have to like actually like paddle out to it, and it's really oh. cool. So it's it's much more. It's realistic. like a simulator. Realistic. Yeah. Okay. yeah, yeah. It's unironically, I remember really liking Transworld Surf. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm excited to play them. Press room. Dark Cloud. A little, little chaos. Dark Cloud and Extermination. Oh, yeah, look at the cute little. Yeah, that's cute. Underpaid uh, <laughs> render guys made that. Dark Cloud. My favorite PS2 game? Um. I don't know. On a peaceful, clear I need to think about night, that. The village of Nauru Ooh, yeah, is that's, that's a good one. It says mine is Battlefront 2. Music floating from below. The villagers dance in celebration of the Harvest Festival. We got a good I'm, Harvest Festival. I'm, I'm hard-pressed not to say God Hand now. From nowhere, really? Your favorite piece of game? Yeah. In one film, yeah. Swoop, the village is gone. Ancient evil I like, I'm still unleashed. thinking about it. I don't know why. This epic journey <laughs> unfolds within the <laughs> mysteries of myths and fairy tales. Yeah, it was a good game. Would oh, no. Be able to revive and restore oh, no. He's going to die, too, now. Yeah, yeah. Where's he going? After the destruction <laughs> yep. of the Western continent, yeah. our main Rip. character, Toan, awakens to total darkness. An old man appears before him and introduces himself as the Spirit Emperor. The Spirit Emperor the bestows a great responsibility on Toan, a young man with a pure heart. He must now rebuild the world that has crumbled before him. Toan's village has been destroyed. God, I just want to ruffle that hair. Look at it. I know. <laughs> to rebuild them, he must <laughs> first get like various mine. parts of the towns that have been dispersed are in, in different dungeons. Yeah. And you put them back together. Well, <laughs> no, they're, no, they're in. They're popular. They're right now. I'm not coping. <laughs> As you do so, you the townspeople are released. And uh, no, I played number two. You. Oh. Well, I, I did play this one to your a long time ago. But... <laughs> this, this one's probably going to be more fun because, well, Dark Cloud 2 is fun. System, it's way the more, uh, there's so many more things the to do uh, that it's like the most innovative too much. Feature this one has less to do. That's better. 
So, it's so yeah, like there's more focus. Being able to build your uh, own say, world and interact. Sounds like the game sucks. You want less of it? Fun. <laughs> well, <laughs> the problem is like <laughs> the problem is that with Dark Cloud 2, it's like there's like 50 million different mechanics, and so after a while, you're like, I don't care about these mechanics. Yeah, like, I don't want to do these. There's a lot. There's fishing, the mech, the photographs, the dungeon the diving, the yeah. village building. There's you begin lot. building by using an overhead. Daniel, view oh Daniel, says Dark Cloud 2 is fire. Oh yeah, I do like Dark Cloud 2. I'm just saying, like, in comparison, to these two games, there's a lot to do with Dark Cloud 2. I really liked it. Absolutely no delay. So Daniel, look at look at them backpedal. Look at that. Look at that. Oh, I know Dark Cloud 2 is not that. Yeah, like <laughs> uh, play as your dream as well. Oh yes, that's your dream. <laughs> I think Dark Cloud. Gonna sucks. Never let me let that out. Beyond this I never new played. Uh, I did play Dark Cloud. System, Dark Cloud I like delivers it. the depth and character development that okay. RPG players demand. There are six oh, yeah, playable characters, characters available over the course of the game. Yep. Yep. Oh, As your God, adventure so continues, hot. you will have to carefully manage their development. Yeah, this yeah, this one looks like it has more focus on the. Uh, the, the dungeoning and fighting and stuff, rather than Various I mean, there's, there's still fairy building, tale town themes building. have been incorporated throughout the game. It is an epic story of good versus evil. I love epic world, stories filled with, with genie good versus evil. Yes. animals and magic. And the creators of Dark Cloud claim that only the power of the PlayStation 2 could bring this sweeping story to life. Was he twerking? <laughs> she, yes. <laughs> was that a he or she? I don't even know. It doesn't even matter. It doesn't matter. That's all, all we need to know is that that was happening. We had grand visions as we began the development of Dark Cloud. There were so many things that we were able to do that we couldn't do before. Oh, everyone's story. Oh, yeah. A lot of realistic details everyone's. that only the PS2 can allow. It's a dream come true. No one needs to feel shame. Just, just shake it a little. Oh, Joe. This is... I know I'm saying this is a lot, a lot, but this is a lot. Oh, they got oh. quick time. Yeah, they got quick time events. Those this games was, are great. This Legend of Dragoon. Oh, yeah, we were talking about Legend of Dragoon earlier. And yeah, play Breath Fire, Castlevania, Symphony of the Night. Yeah, I played all those. For role -playing this is before God of War, quick two. time. Yeah, it is. It is. So, uh, who's the real pioneer? Dark Cloud. Metal Gear Solid, Sons of Liberty is good, too. Oh, yeah. yeah. All right. All right, there we go. I think this is done. <laughs> uh, yes. Okay, do we do extermination? Um, oh, he clicked it. Oops. Yeah. He clicked it. Why did you? Let's, did you want to take a break? No. No, go ahead. Uh, I'll take a break after um, extermination. This summer, you will go on a mission. Oh, look at the action. We're a trailer man voice. Awaits. Oh yeah, he's fear and danger wait at every turn. Every a turn. mission that you may not survive. The they zombies were all out front. The zombies shot down my plane. <laughs> Is that what they are, zombies? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, this looks very uh Resident Evil esque. Huh? Yeah. Whoa. This oh. summer. Faces. Extermination, I called it. <laughs> this summer you will go on a mission. This is extermination. There's more. From Tokuro Fujiwara and his team at I love Tokuchi Fujiwara. <laughs> places you've never been before. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Deep space. Extermination takes place at an underground research facility at the South Pole. Because of the extremely low temperatures, they're able to conduct experiments on dangerous viruses. Suddenly, oh, a distress yeah, signal was sent from the base. This is where COVID and all escaped communications from. are cut off. Oh, God. <laughs> blown off the map. When Dennis Riley no, this game came out. And the Marine Special Forces Red Light Team arrive nope. at yeah, the this, top this, secret. Yeah, this is a game that I, I saw at the uh, at my local place. Have taken the base. It's I get it, but I have so many hell bent on it's pretty good. Members of Red Light. Um, yeah, I, 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 I thought I heard that. It's okay. <laughs> well, there are creatures in the facility that have violently mutated. They spit a green substance, and the infection that they're carrying is spread. Why do I start with, well, well, there's some horribly well, mutated monsters. At first, when you become infected with the virus, take this. you can cure yourself with medicine. You can recover. 
The antibodies will temporarily ward off infection. So, but if you get 100% infected, you can't cure yourself with the regular vaccine anymore. You need to find a treatment pod. When you're infected, your body gets eaten away from the inside. Your strength diminishes over time. When you've deteriorated completely, it's game over. Yeah, this is, uh, this is, uh, Resident Evil Outbreak. Haunts us. AI <laughs> game will never, never Deadly let, mutants, let up its chase. A lethal chase. virus, danger at every turn. Sounds like a classic formula for an action movie. And that's exactly what Deep Space is aimed to create in Extermination. <laughs> an action Sounds like an action movie. That's because it is. Into a world where <laughs> yeah, his actions, really. his fear, and his wits are what control I never get bored of survival horror. I'm surprised they've made so many of them. I know. I, yeah, I, I like survival horror games. Yeah. We had quite a few left to play. We all see tons of films. And they I'm actually excited to play this. They move us, or they excite us. So we wanted to make the action games feel more like a film. <laughs> you either feel emotional or you get a boner. That's the only two options. You get the full flavor and power of it all. Do you know how hard it is making a game when you're gooning the entire time? <laughs> and I think that clearly distinguishes yeah. this man's a gooning pro. With the region action system, you control the character's movement with just one button. For example, <laughs> when you need to jump, hitting the action button will make you jump. If you oh, need it's to a... climb, just hit the same button. That's kind of cool. It's just contextual buttons, but this is, you know, so early. Yeah, yeah, for sure. From the player's point of view, you're closer to being able to react to the game on a split-second gut basis. Oh, okay. Other than his teammates, Sergeant Riley has one crucial companion in the Antarctic cold. His, his gun. advanced, his highly gun. customizable assault rifle. The yes, FDR we're right. Kit. We're right. That's uh, that's pretty cool. You can change out the attachments. The player can rapidly customize the yeah. SPR4. They can find attachments to make it into a flamethrower, a grenade launcher, okay. or numerous other weapons. It's it's interesting. So it's interesting too because um this is so early PlayStation and yet these games had so much so many mechanics you know Dark Cloud this one yeah you know you're right though they weren't um they weren't super simple games I guess they had a lot of mechanics you had to learn I can see why they are 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 talking about these two because there are a lot of mechanics so there's a lot to actually talk about. Yeah, he not um, only supervised the parts it's interesting because I feel like games, if anything, firearms. have been simplified all over sorts time, of advice, you know. Such as how the characters should handle the weapons, how they should look while they're firing. We even took some of the movement oh, nice. in the game from the demonstrations he gave us. From the detailed weaponry to movie quality cutscenes so that lead you through the they story. They really tried to make it uh, realistic in the shooting. Extermination is a summer blockbuster you won't want to miss. Tuna, you're not going to want to miss this, man. Uh, I, you know, I'm, I'm, I, I, I'm busy. My, <laughs> my, uh, I have a piano. My dog has piano lessons. Uh, it's really hard to make time, you know. But look, you can rescue teammates. I like games with detailed mechanics. Yeah, yeah, oh, for sure. For sure. This summer. Whoa, did you see that explosion? Oh my god. Bro! Some red barrels. The extermination? Oh, welcome to the endangered species list. Fuck oh, you. No. Uh, Get fucked this summer. <laughs> <laughs> this is 2001. Yes, yes. Yep. I keep thinking All of right. that. I keep thinking of Dead Space. They keep saying Deep Space. I know. That's. I was going to say something about that earlier. I was like, this feels like... Dead Space. All right, we've looked at everything but the vault. The vault. Uh, let's take a quick break. Because I need to run a bathroom okay, in an hour. Um, we do, 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 <laughs> uh, Piano. Like Half-Life graphics? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yep, they have some, they had some good visuals. Um, surprisingly nice, uh... Surprisingly nice details. Uh, I, you know, like, just, just, okay, Zora, just remember, we played Horses from 2006, and that thing was horrendous. This is what we've got coming out in 2001. This is what we got coming out in 2001. I think they oversell it. Uh, they might. 
Sure. Maybe. They're ve oh yeah, they're they're very passionate about that. This summer. I fell for the hype. Oh yes. So now I've gotta see some of the games on the demo disc. Um We'll find some good. I know there's. I, I, I was reading some of the games on here. So uh, okay, yeah. Actually, give me one second. I'm gonna go upstairs. I'm gonna grab. Uh, gonna grab some medicine before I uh, start feeling like crap. So iconic blood will be a Tony Hawk demo on this. I don't know. We're so in just a minute. We're so we've looked through all of the options except for the vault. So we'll see if there's a Tony Hawk demo on this. There might be. It might be four. We're not sure. So everyone, I'm gonna put. Is it this? I don't know what this is. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'll be right back. Yeah, dude. Influenza A. It's been crazy. It's been crazy. I don't understand, man. It's been like a week. It's been a week. We've all felt like crap. Uh, we all feel like crap. It doesn't help that I'm still taking a gummy. So I'm like extra loopy. But uh, I'll be right back. I'm going to go grab some medicine and uh, 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 we'll we'll play some of the games in the vault. So I'll, uh, I'll keep them entertained. Uh, hey, hey guys, uh, hold on. Hold on, I got a joke for you. Uh, uh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Are you guys holding on? Are you there? Hello? Is my mic on? Oh, these are... I, I googled bad jokes. These are terrible. What did the fish say when he swam into a wall? I'll give you guys a minute. What did the fish say when he swam into a wall? Uh, damn. Hello? Is my mic on? <laughs> Joke, come back. <laughs> what do you call a can opener that doesn't work? A can't opener. Alright, Joe. Streaming's hard. What are you talking about? What are you guys talking about when you stream? I need to be, like, entertaining, right? I can't stream. I don't stream. What does Joe talk about? I guess he just talks to chat. So I guess chat makes the content. Um, imagine a surprise virtual video demo on this. Bro. Yeah, we got the, we got the vault. I don't want to go in until Joe's back, though. What games do you guys think are in here? Ace Combat? Dark Cloud? I want uh usually they have um Usually the games they have aren't if they have videos of the games, they don't include the same demos of those games. That's been my experience with demos. Um demo discs. One left. Yeah, Joe still um sounds a little sick. I'm, I'm so tempted. I'm so tempted, okay. but I can't. I'm um, making a surprise virtual view demo. Uh, okay, hold on. Uh, Matthew, you're sick. Oh no! How to get the? Okay, so we're actually using um emulator. Hold on, I'm sorry. One second. Yep. Oh, we're actually using uh, emulator. Sorry, I also couldn't hear you, so I'm sure you were talking. I'm so sorry. I just like. Start talking over the top of you. Oh, no worries. Are you ready for the vault? Vault? Yes, let me uncheck. Be right back. Eh. Okay. Let's check out the vault. A snowboarding game, yeah. Oh. Oh, thank you, Frost. I am on stream. Yeah, yeah. Not, I'm, I'm not a good streamer. <laughs> no, he's just not. He, he's just not used to it yet. He's a good streamer. Oh yeah. Got big. Uh, uh, what was the robot thing called? Big. 
It wasn't Big D. <laughs> Big D? Voltron? No, the robot anime. Big something. That's Outlaw Star, Dundome, Sailor Moon. Big, big something. Was it big something? Yeah, that's a stupid name. Dragon Ball Z, of course. Johnny was great. It was where I first saw um, all my first my animes, which I'm not really a fan of anymore. But they're okay. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> but yeah, first anime, Dragon Ball Z, and Yuasha, Outlaw Star. I think the creator of Outlaw Star is. No, that's Rurouni Kenshin. Not a good dude. <laughs> oh. Sad day. Escaflone. Escaflone! He's in there. Yeah, Tsunami was great. Um, just watch it all the time. Okay. You know what? I, I, I've said it before, but there's I have a funny story about Escaflone. I'm pretty sure um, they had like Saturday morning cartoons for me. Mm -hmm. And one year, they showed Escaflone as coming to the Saturday morning cartoons. It played the first episode and then never played again. I don't have any proof of this. But I remember sitting there on a Saturday morning watching it, and it was bloody. And I was like, oh, this is great. Now I'm an adult. I'm like, oh, yeah, that's probably why they took it off air. Uh, uh, what were they thinking? It had um, gore in it or some blood? Mm. Yeah, there's a lot of blood. A lot of people die in the first episode. <laughs> oh, dang. Yeah. I wonder if they got complaints or something. Uh, they had to have, man. Had to have. Okage um, has really surprisingly good writing. Is it really? It's like actually kind of funny. Samurai X. And I feel like doing comedy in games is ridiculously hard. It is. But it's like, it, it's like, I don't know, it's decently written. Is, it, is this a demo or is this just a video? Oh. Do we not have any demos on here? Do I hit, hit X? Okay, I hit X, nothing. No, oh, just a video, I guess. What? Okay, uh, next one. <laughs> oh, this is, okay, mm. this is a game. This demo. Ricky Carmichael. <laughs> oh, I, was, I, no, I, didn't, I thought that was a chatter. <laughs> <laughs> no, MX2002 featuring I, Ricky no, Carmichael. I looked over in chat, I'm like, Ricky Carmichael, I, I didn't see him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not going to remember these controls. Iconic Blood remembers that too? You remember it being... Wait, what, what do you remember? You're, are you saying you remember Escaflone coming on to Saturday morning cartoons and then getting kicked off? Crazy. I hope that's what he's saying. You guys are just having a Berenstein Bears moment. Stop it! Or a uh, Fruit of the Loom moment. That one, that one has already been shown to be... Um, <laughs> Uh, it, it, it was, there's a bunch of, uh, was it, was of there like gaslighting everyone. What happened? No, no, no. It was, it was literally off brand stuff that oh, had that, 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 that thing behind it from like China or something. And it came over and there's a lot of it because I remember seeing it too. Cornucopia. Yeah. Yeah. That there is, there are, there are some. So yeah, the cornucopia. I don't, yeah. I don't understand cornucopias because like, it just feels like a bad, a bad basket that spills everything. <laughs> It does crazy? seem like it. No, no, you're not. All I know in Cornucopia, you get the you like pilgrims, and they had a cornucopia. I'm like, that basket doesn't look like it works very well. <laughs> Why'd they make it all loopy at the end? <laughs> right, One episode on Saturday on Channel 5 in New York, then never shown again. Okay, good, good. And you know what? New York is the same time zone as me, so I, I would absolutely... We probably saw it the same morning. We're like, yeah, Escaflote, and then I just never came back on. It's French actually the first... French? What's that? Is it French? I don't know. It sounds like a French anime. Um, I don't know. Which I don't think it's Maybe? a thing, but they had uh, uh, when Netflix came out, and you could get because Netflix was originally you had you had to uh, borrow the discs from them. I that was the first anime I watched. Was uh, I realized I could go watch it. This is <laughs> this is hard. Nice. How do you? Okay. <laughs> Make sure to lean. Woo! Uh, forward and backward, forward and backward in the air. Can you play this game? No. Alright, I'm gonna just. Oh, <laughs> dude, you see that? Nice! Heartbreaker! Oh, sh. They're gonna send me a bucket hat from Cool. <laughs> cargo shorts. Oh, you got Turf Wrestler. Yes. I'm a Turf Wrestler. Is the, I think the thing on the right is like. Is that like pre preloading my jumps? Uh. What are you pressing for that to do that? 
Yeah, try it. Hold it down and let go. Nothing, but I think you gotta pop a jump. Yeah, I think. It, yeah, yeah, it's giving me like more air. Oh, there we go. I'm gonna be honest. This control is not, 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 not great. It seems like it's not. I can't, how do I get back in? <laughs> Just crack. <laughs> Slide underneath the, the banner. We got squares break, X's go. We got the TH. Hey, uh, Joe, who made this game? <laughs> uh, THQ. Uh, are you sure? I think. I think it might be, but we hmm. might have to double check the wiki. Yeah, can you double check that? I'm not, who made the. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not seeing a lot of THQ stuff on my <laughs> screen right now. <laughs> I wish they had branded themselves properly in this game. Uh, uranium, we got every demo disc. To the, yeah, don't worry, don't worry, it's it's on the emulator, so no, we will not have any memory cards destroyed by Beautiful Joe 2. Oh, yeah, I saw that. My, uh, my best friend at the time, he he got it, and he, uh, before anyone knew, that weekend, he got the, the demo disc and used it, and it de destroyed his uh, Gran Turismo saves. I saw that on Reddit, on the PS2, someone mentioned it. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. I did a do a Superman! Can you do a Superman? What are the trick buttons? You're asking questions that I don't have answers to, huh? <laughs> <laughs> that was good. I did a... That was a L1 and R1 does that, apparently. I'm in last place. So let's see if we can... This is... This looks like it's running poorly. <laughs> are you talking about the quality of the game or the... Uh... Yeah, yeah. I'm just going to hug you. <laughs> It's just gone. It didn't even look like you guys finished. I don't even know where the finish line actually was. Oh god. Yeah, that's not that's that that wasn't good. I mean this was well yeah, this was yeah. I'm trying to think there was uh ATV versus MX out. ATV versus what was it called? Those games were good. Uh oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Those ones are good, but Yeah. Portal Runner. Oh, oh god. I don't know anything about this game. This looks uh -uh. Like Bubsy. It does. I was just gonna say, God damn it, you got to it before I did. <laughs> Man, I would be pissed if my Grand Christmas saves were gone. That's it. Iconic blood. I or I iconic. Ionic. I know what I'm trying to say here. Uh yeah, so so his Grand Christmas saves were gone. I helped him. I came over and I spent the entire weekend at his house and we played uh Grand Trismo the entire time. And we got a save back to where it was. Uh but it was literally cool. us being up all night playing for two days. God, wait, like wait, some, what? This is some shit. You, you're like your 3DO. Mom buys, your mom buys you a toy, and it's like a knockoff Amazon, Amazonian. <laughs> yeah. Hey, on the, yeah. On, the, on the the action figure cardboard, it just says like Amazonian action fighter. It's like from China. They should. Be saying, oh God. Like and her eyes are painted on crossed. <laughs> yeah. I like the uh, little text how it how it uh, uh, jumbles. Oh yeah, yeah. It's like a. Oh, it's portal. like. Oh no, we're trapped. Why would that portal have been made from wood? I don't... It's really quiet. Yeah, it is. Oh, it's cell games. Wait, there's oh god chess. What is hap? What are we they're looking gonna... at? <laughs> they're gonna murder that old man. Oh no. <laughs> How would she know about that? Uh, maybe the wizard is. Maybe the wizard's a bad dude. Oh my! Oh, oh god! <laughs> Joe, help! Um, um, pick up no. some arrows. Ow. He's on my ass, bro. Ow. Oh, oh! There you go! There you go! Oh, dead! Does it hurt me? In the middle. Oh. <laughs> I got checkmated. Oh, <laughs> this is Joe. This is horrible. <laughs> I can't wait to play it. The camera. If you move the camera, it stays where you position it. It doesn't like auto recenter. Oh no. I do like the um. Oh god, I don't mean to look under her skirt. You the reflections like... are a little hard though. Like on this yeah. surface right now. Yes, they're very um. Pronounced. Ugh, ugh, ugh. What's what's the point of his shield? Save the wizard from the knights. Oh, he died. You let him die. How dare you? <laughs> oh god. 
Okay, let's see if we can Just fire, here. fire, fire! I have limited arrows. Yeah, yeah. You don't want to see what's on that wizard's hard drive. I don't think he's a good dude. <laughs> You have zero arrows. No arrows. <laughs> Why is your health so freaking low, man? Oh, she screams checkmate. What is this, the Gex of PlayStation 2? Well done, young lady. Now we need to find our way out of here. How does she get in? That arrow might be just That's a good question. Trick. Jank? No, this game is super buttery smooth. <laughs> yeah, this game. Whoa, what's uh, oh, what happened? Now there's a bunch of platforms above your head. Yeah, I need some health. That gives you like one bar, bro. How yeah. many does it give you? One. <laughs> oh my god. Curse of beautiful Joe, uranium. I appreciate that. That's very nice of you. Oh, oh there's first person mode. Oh, oh my god. It's like um, you're it's like a, a Skyrim archer. Oh, oh, you can hang on. It's like, oh. a, it's like the, those bad Wii games. <gasps> oh, yeah. Shoot 100 balloons. This music is going to drive me to kill. Well. Oh, your jump is so pathetic. Please let her get across. Oh, my God. Yeah. Is this a Laura jump? Oh, she, um, when she oh, lands, no. she kind of, like, keeps going a little bit. Oh. No, oh, actually, no. Tomb Raider's way better. Does that hurt me? The black squares hurt me. Okay. The what? Well, what are you supposed to do? Does it change color? You're supposed to not play this game. Oh, oh. Okay. I didn't realize they rotated like that. It's gonna take forever. Weird. Oh no. Yeah. Just, just run. This, this fucking sucks. <laughs> Get the heart. Yes. I have um I have like a high tolerance for like for bad games and stuff. Um, well, I, don't, I don't know they're all black. Um yeah I have a high tolerance for bad games but this is legitimately oh. really un un unenjoyable to play. Oh man he took it. <laughs> where do I where do I go? I oh, just jump. I need the arrow. That's right. Okay. Oh there's ice arrows. There's an ice arrow behind you there. No I just I want the I just I want this to end. <laughs> <laughs> You're just gonna have to go. Yeah, I just wanna. Bro, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I... I'm gonna lose it if I fall. I'm actually gonna die. No, you've got, you've got a heart. Yeah. Um... Uh... Uh, no. Oh my God! No, quit. <laughs> what? What a game. Explore four fantastic action packs. Four worlds. Attack with Vicky's bow and you, Leo's ferocious. Cl do you think the whole game takes place in that in the chess place, or do you think it branches out? <laughs> I would hope so. Oh, that's uh, so bad. That what a weird game. What a weird game. What is that game called? Portal Runner. Portal Runner. Yeah, there's no I'm, setup. It was just, it was just go. I felt like I walked in the middle of a, of someone else's bad trip. Oh, hey, you could try Connecticut. Connecticut. Ooh. Skins. Oh, sex. Skin. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, look at her butt. Just, you know. Can I play this one handed? Oh. No more chess, Barbie, please. Oh, God, this camera. Can you play? Cool. This game has been known to be played with one hand. Yeah, that's good. For those of you. Yeah, this camera angle is really on a, on a bash. Uh, what's the word? Um, yeah, 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 exactly. <laughs> no more chess, Barbie, please. Wait, do you get to play this? Oh, yeah, I don't know. Maybe this is just a video. Like Okage. I like hard rock music and babes. <laughs> and whacking off, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm being uh, toxic right now. No, no, this is exactly what's happening. I'm gonna play. Yeah. Mecca. 
and jack off. Uh, Sorry. Wait, no, 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 wait a minute. Yeah. They give us a demo disc with all of these awesome videos on it, and then they give us Portal Runner and MX with Ricky Carmichael. <laughs> What's happening? Yeah. Portal Runner looks like College Project. Yeah, I thought these would be demos, all of them. Why this has got to be though, right? Yeah, why aren't the why aren't these in the video section? Uh, I TV don't know. Generation games. Yeah, this is very MTV. Uh, no, I feel like MTV had more self awareness. I would hope. I suck at Connecticut. Hey, bro, this is so many directions. I can't. Okay, I don't know. That's, that's too much. My brain. Just just hit X and then hit as many buttons as you can every time you have a chance. True. Just I'm gonna blah, do, blah, blah, blah. I'm gonna do a kick clip. Like Do a cake flip. Yeah. I feel like Idle Minds did. Ah, oh, they did. What did they do? Ah, oh, there's a there's a game I'm thinking of. I can't remember. Call it snowboarding game. He did. Brent. He did. He's got the tribal tats, bro. <gasps> you can be. Just cool. Wait, what's her name? Oh, literally just cool. <laughs> I like cool. <laughs> it says right there, I'm cool, and cool says they're cool. You're a bad man. Check out the sensor. Oh god. Dang. Oh yeah, I'm cool. Hey now, Trent. <laughs> I don't like Trent. Trump Trump's yeah, comes by. He, he, I'm working at the fast food Taco Bell. Trent comes by. He's always asking for free shit. It's really annoying. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and whenever like whenever you like need stuff, he always wants to talk and it's like, bro, I don't want to can you just leave? This is awkward. I just want, I just want my weed, bro. Trent. <laughs> lady the killer. lady killer. Uh, Trent looks a little young to be a lady killer. Huh? Smooth dude. Yeah, sure. All right, what do we get? What is it? Divide Evergreen. Evergreen run and divide board park. Boulder Phoenix. Okay. Phoenix. Is that a? Is that a? It's not an anagram. What is it? <laughs> Phil Weeks. Man, this is like SSX, but bad. Trent has no yeah. Because the meth keeps him. No, if he was the meth. Uh... So called little dude MJ. Trent has no jet. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Where do you go? Oh. Oh, this okay. actually, graphically, this looks really cool. Like, the background, it looks, like, rendered and stuff. This is. Oh, yeah, it does. This looks really nice. Like, the mountain actually looks like it's not just, like, a backdrop. What What music? Yeah. Cool music. You have 40 seconds. What the fuck? That's so like, little. How do I? Shift 8. Ooh, I remember playing Cool Borders 2 on the PlayStation 1 a lot. Yeah, me too, actually. I, um, you, you liked uh, Cool Borders 2? Oh, no. Yeah, I remember really liking Cool Borders. On, um, actually, uh, I loved uh, Sledstorm. It's awesome. Oh, Sledstorm. Sledstorm, yeah, you should play Sledstorm. Uh, you can't, PS1. Damn it. There's a, there's a PS2 Sledstorm. It's weird, because there's Sledstorm on the PS1, there's Sledstorm on the PS2. They're very different games. Oh. Sledstorm on the PS1 is great. Uh, it's got that terrible Rod, Rod, uh, Rob, Rob Zombie song. Ah, uh, wait, what? Is that it? Oh, fuck me, I guess. They okay. gave you one minute of in-game time to play. Yeah, and I didn't even, like, learn anything. Okay, um, jeez. Okay. I was, like, half-tempted to go back, but... I, that's cool for I mean, yeah, th literally you're going to do the same thing. It's going to give you a minute, and you're not going to get to the end. Oh, they actually have Eco. gameplay for this. I have a... I'm going to try not to be biased. I feel like I'm really not going to like Eco. Oh, no. Yeah. Everyone, get ready. Get your pitchforks ready. Yeah. I was gonna, Last longer than me. I'm gonna, I was going to make a video because the guy mentioned before Battlefront 2. I'm sorry. I forgot who mentioned Battlefront 2. Someone said it was their favorite PS2 game. I was. Uh, Zoom is Arc. Zoom is Arc. When um, the Classic Collection was coming out, before it was coming out, I was thinking about making a video saying Battlefront 2, the Battlefront games are actually bad. The original ones. I was going to make that <laughs> video, but then I didn't. But I thought about it. Ooh. Um, the thought is damning, too. Yeah. How dare he have um, it? I think they're... I was going to make a video. I think they're overrated. Yeah. Oh, the original ones? Yeah, I think so. Um, and I think a lot of it is because I think the actual combat is really bad. I think the movie really? is really bad. Really? Yeah. 
I, I think uh, for a lot of people back then, too, it was also the online portion of it, like being able to play and fight people online in a Star Wars battle yeah. type of uh, format. Yeah, I guess I won't get into it because I was I had like a list of things I didn't like. Um, and overall, the game is fine. It's like a, for me, it's like a, it's like a five out of ten. I don't know. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. Demos that come out today last three hours and that's too long and now this is too short. Yeah, dude, this is like no time at all. And nowadays, sometimes you can hack demos nowadays to just have the whole game. <laughs> yeah, this is, yeah. Yeah, that's, I, I'm not adding any commentary, my bad. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no, you're good. Yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm playing as the Wander. Wander. Wanda. From, um, what's that game? Shadow of the Colossus. There you go. I got a stick, I got a jump. Yeah, this controls just like uh, Shadow of the Colossus. Good deal, good deal. I do like that, um kind of, you know, kind of momentum based movement. Um, it does feel more realistic. Oh, you're not calling for your horse now. You're calling for the girl. Yeah. They really just borrowed a lot of mechanics. Not in a bad way, but. I mean, right, right. Yeah. Like they, they, they definitely use mechanics that worked before and in a different way too. Like you called for your horse. Now you're calling for the girl here. It's, it's like a secondary mechanic. You know, it's not super important. Yeah. What are you doing? I don't know, but I like it. <laughs> Stomp. I don't know what I'm saying. I don't know, but I like it. The slam his face in the wall. Oh, this camera. Oh, God, you can really just play like this, I guess. <laughs> wow. Right. Yeah, I feel like Ico is a game that has... Um, the... What's the word for the big vastness the melancholy of shadow of the colossus but it probably didn't execute on that very well that's the sense i get uh, I, I haven't played it i feel like it's a yeah little... once you do what's that is it will, will you will you play this at some point um no i i mean no. at some point okay fair enough um, i mean super no rush to play Ico. that's fair that's fair um, Ico was a strange game yeah jay hanks says it's a strange game it's very much, it's just, um, it could be good. It's just very much not a game I'm um, interested in what it does well. Super not up my alley. I really like Shadow of the Colossus, though. But Shadow of the Colossus, I yeah, like it's fun, because, yeah. Um, yeah, I like it because of the time and place. If you play it now, it's it's diminished a lot because it, it doesn't have that wow factor it had. A big part of Shadow of the Colossus, where did I go? What, sorry, what opened? Uh, thing, You know what? I don't remember. Thing We're talking. Yeah. Sorry, I think open somewhere. Um, Shadow of the Colossus was very much a huge appeal of it was um, how different it was, and then how um, surprising it was. The and then if you are kind of what about that door underneath there? Oh, you're right. That there it is. If you're spoiled on what the game is, then that's kind of that takes away a huge amount of the wow factor. Ah, yeah. Like the first time you jump on the bird, the water bird that comes at you, like that was a huge. I still remember that vividly. That was like a huge, like whoa, what the fuck. Yeah, it was it was a cool thing to do. Like, yeah. there's just a good, uh, the good idea. And when it happening, the music swells at the perfect time, and yeah, it just it's games that do stuff like that. But uh, now, if you you know you see video about it, you're like, eh, eh. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, I hate to say, it, but I don't think a demo of this would have convinced someone to buy it back in the day. Yet yeah, right now, it's very like all the other games at least were. <laughs> um, <laughs> what are you doing to that chain? <laughs> Poor Jade. I agree, though. I agree. I don't think this 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 right here would have helped. It um. Can I not stop climbing? Oh, it's okay. The controls are weird. Sorry, it's like he doesn't stop. How do you? I can't. He just keeps climbing. There we go. It's <laughs> there um. There it is. How do you? I want to drop down, but I don't want to. Okay. Um. Uh, yeah, I think you know. Um, this is very much a game of either like it or you don't, I feel like. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, good. look at this. Bro, you got to use your back. You got to use your, not your back, your uh, your thighs. What are we doing? <laughs> it looks video. like... <laughs> I love the animation. <laughs> is the last Guardian game a part of this world? Oh, you know what? I, I know that they're all somewhat interconnected, but I don't know how interconnected. That one you'd have to look for... Uh, community online to see how they connect there i think i i don't think they're the same universe i think they're just um 
I don't think they're connected. I think they're just, you know, same developer and then same. Yeah. Mode. I bought this because it was the s- sequel. Wait, this isn't a sequel, right? Yeah, I go isn't this... first and then. So this would be the prequel. Yeah. Um, I mean, prequel, they have nothing in common as far as I know. They're not like. Not oh, yeah. Yeah, that's they're... right. It's just same to dev and then kind of same game, gameplay in a way. Ah, same uh... style. Then they're connected in the way that Max Payne and Control from Remedy are connected. Yeah, I would. I would say. Are, um, are they? I would say Max Payne and Control are more connected because I think those canonically the developer with uh, with uh, what game just came out. What was their newest game? Alan Wake Two. Um, oh. That's been canonized as actually being in the same universe, and so I mean I don't think there's any official connection between these games, but. Oh yeah, I don't know. It feels like there is, but I don't know. Maybe there is. Ico is the sequel? I don't know about that. Um, no, Ico is I, first. I'm pretty confident. Well, you're making me doubt myself. I'm pretty sure Ico is first. Oh, plot-wise. Plot-wise. Um, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, the Alan Wake, you know, the Remedy Connected Universe has been officially... They officially put it all together in Alan Wake 2. But uh, the... The voice actor just passed away from, so I don't, I feel, yeah, I don't know. That's a weird situation with Remedy. Uh, Their games don't sell well, and, you know, a big voice actor they used to use all the time passed away, and so uh, I don't know what they're going to do in the future. Last I heard, Alan Wake 2 did not sell. I think, I think it was a big news story, actually, I think. I think I got a saver. I don't, I don't want to. Cir- circle? No. Circle. No. R2? Oh, God. Ow. What was the button? Uh, um, L1. Oh, L1. Okay. Hold. I know you think here, so. Um, the character... So, so explains where the horn kick comes from? Oh. There are different characters, but, um, they do, you can tell, they do share a lot in common with the... He's got the poncho and the, and the horns, the orange helmet. Wait, are you saying Shadow of the Classes, the, the kid with the horns here, is actually the kid, the baby? Oh, that's a good, that could be uh, true, yeah. Because at the end, ah, spoilers. <laughs> but at the end, yeah. Um, see you, Go- Goji. Thanks for stopping by. Yes! Take it easy, dude. Take it easy, dude. Thanks for coming by and uh, hanging out. Yeah, because at the end, um, the dude gets sucked into the thing, and then Horn Baby comes out. And that could be the horn. Well, yeah. Why does this have kid have a horned helmet then? In that case, I I was wondering like, are those actual horns from his head, or are they on the helmet itself? Yeah, it's a weird. I I you know I wouldn't be surprised if there's no real definitive answer. I wouldn't be surprised if it's just kind of stuff to make you go, hmm, interesting. That's fair. <gasps> oh my, my bad. All right, listen, lady, you're gonna have to start pulling your weight here. It's not the baby, but some kind of descendant. Oh, so it's not the baby directly. Uh, wait, are, does, do you guys have to go up there? No, if I just hold R1, I kind of tell her to get over here. No, I mean, uh, w- where do you have to take her right now? Oh, um, I mean, this is the only way, I think, isn't it? Is there something I'm missing? Well, because once you get over here, where do you go? That's true. Oh, this camera. This game is also Almost... super fuzzy. I mean, it's Shadow of the Colossus was, too. Okay. Yeah, uh, sorry. My oh, bad. damn. My bad, my bad. I think you do have to bring something out of the wall there, but I think you might have to do that first. Or, 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 or move those. Yeah, I think you're... Oops. Nothing, no buttons work. She came down through the, the grate. There's a ladder. Oh, maybe you could uh, boost her up or boost yourself up uh, to the wait. ladder? I, I think that goes... Yeah, I think you're right. She's like, all right, all right, hold mm-hmm. on. Shadow of the class was going to end up different? Was it really? I know that they cut a lot of the original Colossi, but that was probably after they had already decided it was Shadow of the Classes. 
Yeah, that's an interesting thing too, because um, a lot of times people will see what's on the cutting room floor and be like, oh, this game could have been amazing. Um, but I always, I usually take the opposite approach. I usually think a lot of the stuff they cut is probably for the best. Yeah, I mean, it wouldn't have been able to be a good game had they not. Because like with Shadow of the Colossus, they, uh, I saw stuff, you know, they had like, they had a lot. I, is it 16 Colossi? I think it's in the final thing. Um, yeah. They were going to do a bunch more. They were going to do like 20, yeah, like whatever. 30 or 40. 40, yeah, it's like. Was their very first, yeah. Oh, yeah. The game was already a little too long, um, in my opinion, so. You have to search the documentary about it and also a search about the secret. It's quite the story. Oh, yeah. I remember the secret, but uh, I, I don't think I watched the documentary stuff. Is there a way to? Uh... Um, her, the co-op button doesn't seem to. There's just kind of a co-op button that calls her or it holds her hand. It doesn't seem to. doesn't seem to do anything else. 48 is way too many. Uh, yeah. That's right. 24, then it ended up being 16. Yeah. I have a feeling it's got to be this. Yeah, these things really stick out. Like, maybe she has to help you move it? Yeah, maybe with our combined strength, we can, like, pull it or something. Interesting thing, you can't seem to... Oh, oh, yeah. Oh. Well, duh. Of course... Of course she's going to use her power to move the blocks. What was, <laughs> yeah. I, what was I thinking? Yeah, I had no clue she had powers. Don't leave her behind. Oh, yeah, I don't, I, don't like, I don't like escorting. <laughs> Is this the end of the demo right here? It's interesting how little impact The Last Guardian had compared to Ico. Oh, yeah. Yeah, well, it seemed at first like it was going to be interesting, and then I think it just kind of fell flat. Yeah, I think I got the sense that people didn't like The Last Guardian. That it was kind of a bad game. Sadly. Did you have to hold her hand to get her through the door? No, oh, she's not going to follow. Joe, Joe's got a sixth sense for games. <laughs> I don't want to go back because it's going to do the cutscene. It might... Where is she, is she gonna come? She does not want to. Oh, please. Oh, I gotta help her up. How about you, tell, how about you kinetic shoot yourself up here? I know, she has powers. Levitate, yeah. Magneto levitate or something, I don't know. Magneto levitates, <laughs> right? I don't know. Magneto, yeah. <laughs> I'm thinking of PsyOps, because in that game you can use your mind powers to. You can jump on like a piece of metal and use it to levitate. It's pretty sick. Oh, yeah, there you go. My mind just went there. I don't know why. Whoop. Nice. Ooh, boy. <laughs> I, am, uh, <laughs> I am just about done with this game. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, that, that that's fine. Uh, I think a lot of it, too, is just, like, yeah. trying this stuff out. I mean, it's probably going to end shortly. Yeah, it's you know you you do puzzles together. You know if you're into that, some people are really into that style of game. Not for me. So I can't hate. Not for Tuna. Yeah, I like Sha uh, I like I love, I love Shadow of the Colossus, but uh, that was more of an action game than puzzle game. So. Yeah, yeah, the puzzle was action based rather than. Yeah, it was more enjoyable for a simpleton like me, like my dumbass. <laughs> I want to hit the big monsters with my stick sword my magical sword and then and then that gushes out the black goo stuff it's pretty sick it's the best it's well, absolutely no, uh, jungle slider. oh geez do we want the jungle slider the sea of tears well the sea of tears sounds not like a good time yeah <laughs> it sounds like a, it's been cried the sea of tears has been cried by someone one of my favorite uh youtube videos is a review about klonoa 2 you <gasps> yeah you were telling me yeah, I like that video a lot. Oomph. Ow. Wahoo! Bing, bing, wahoo. I need to play this soon. I have it. Yeah, people. Cool classic. People love Klonoa. Now they're speaking some made up language. I think so.
No, it's like a it's like a weird <coughs> French made up made up French language. Yeah. It's like French Japanese. That's Why don't cool. they say their names the way that they're spelled and said in? Um, what do you mean? Everyone has said their name differently than what it is. You know what I mean? Like the, the, their their language has them saying their their names differently than what we would call them. In English, like Lolo or Lulu, whatever her name is. She said her name was like slightly different. Oh. And this guy's name is Popka, but she said Pop, and that was it. Oh, you're right. I don't know. So, so yeah. uh, unless you really don't say the ka part, then. Yeah. Huh. Interesting. Yeah, Klano is like uh, it's like mushed together. Yeah. See, Lulo, unless that really is what it is. Oh, so bizarre. Hey you. Hey. Oh no. Hey, 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 hey. Nabi. <laughs> Let's get the show on the road. Ooh. <laughs> I think that's the goal. I think so. You sure? I don't know. Vision start. Oh, D-pad only. Okay. That's like Wild. Oh, nine. really? Yeah. yeah you, ever, you ever play Wild Nine? Uh, no. Probably for the best. <laughs> oh God. That's kind of cute. You can do it in different directions. Okay, okay. Slam him. Okay. Nice. Slam it. Oh, you need to save one. Oh, you need to jump up high. Yeah, I wonder if you can jump on I think you can use the enemies. Oh, you can, like, float. No, that hurts me. I think you pick them up and then you... Yeah. Yeah, there you go. I got some... Myst we got some... Not mystical. We got some fun music that doesn't quite match the level itself. Wait, what about the egg? I don't care about the egg. Oh! <gasps> How fine, dare he? Fine. I'll get the egg. Let's see. Yay. Got the egg. You happy now? Yeah, you got a health. Yeah, I am too. It was worth it. Good call. <laughs> now, how do you get up there and then to jump off? Oh, maybe the, the, the tornado. Yeah. Oh, you're right. Yeah, you do that, and then... That's kind of cool. I like this so far. It's like, it's like teaching you the mechanics in a simple but fun way. Yeah, yeah, they, they, they keep making enemies spawn nearby so you can use them over and over to try the different, uh... Yeah. Oh, man, this is... It's a little hard to play with my pants around my ankles, though. <laughs> oh, that's Pete. right. What was that? Rest in peace, Matthew Perry. He got died in his jacuzzi. <laughs> Doing drugs, apparently. Don't do drugs, kids. You'll end up... Yeah. Jacuzzi... Soup. I would never even touch a drug. True. Although one time I did do salvia. Oh, no. was it, it was great. Was it in the forest? <laughs> no, no, no. No. Is that the drug you do in the forest? No, that's uh, ayahuasca. That's right. That's right. See, I don't do drugs, so I don't even. I don't even. <laughs> now salvia was like for a while it was legal it's like 15 minute little hallucination and that's it you can you literally could just go buy it oh weird yeah from a store Which... uh, it, it's not legal to buy but it's also not illegal to have just you can't go buy it at a store what <laughs> so like it's it's no, illegal I... to sell it yeah, i guess yeah. it's in one of those weird gray zones where it's yeah yeah which you would never do of course because drugs are bad yeah, yeah, drugs are so bad. Oh no, no, you know what it was? It was, it was, it was 15 minutes of, um, I, I saw, I saw, uh, Hades from Hercules and Genie, their faces because they're blue, and they were like tiled. Disney cartoon. Yeah, yeah, did did di Disney movies, both of them, Genie and and Hades, uh, just their faces, and they were tiled, and they were spinning around me, and I thought it was the most hilarious thing I've ever seen. So I laughed hysterically for 15 minutes, and then I felt good all day. I was like, oh, yeah, this is a great, it's a great feeling. Hypothetically, because you never do drugs. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's, yeah. 
That's my Joe Hannon lore. <laughs> he, was, he was huge into abs abstinence. <laughs> was that you? Yeah, you. Um, I heard you volunteer at the Dare program for your local your local schools. Is that right? I I did. I did. Yeah, it was. I was very passionate about. Yeah, that's what I heard about. Dare. <laughs> Speaking of, drugs, is that stuck in the annoying. ground? Yeah, it's not. It's not coming undone. Uh oh. But I think you need it. I need it. Yeah, this music does not. Does it, can this shoot me? I can't move. The only buttons seem to shoot me out of it. This music is too upbeat for the storm one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, this seems like a. This is a Sea of Tears. What is uh oh. This? Is this stuck? Yeah, like you're go go back in the door and come back in and see if maybe. I like the little transition. It's cute. Uh, yeah, it's cute transition. But yeah, I think I'm under it. Yes. Yeah, I think I'm under it. I think I'm stuck. I think the game is messed up. <gasps> That's oh. crazy. Yeah, because now I'm in it. Huh. Well, that's Klonoa. <laughs> it seems cool. Um, I actually do want to play this. It seems really cool. It yeah, it, 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 I remember playing it a long time ago. It was pretty fun. Yeah, it's Klonoa. Klonoa. Um, oh, and the rain stops when you're inside the cave. That's cute. <gasps> yeah. Oh, look at the big guy in the middle. Yeah, and they jump back and forth in the foreground, background. Oh, my God. He's huge. And then you actually run in the background. The camera changes. That's cool. I like that. Oh, no. I can't leave. Go. Select? No, nothing. I'm gonna kill me. Kill me. Kill me! Bleah! I got four lives. <gasps> oh, no. oh, and it put you all the way back here? That's so bizarre that it, it catches there. Yeah, you think it'd be every screen, maybe? Maybe that's too generous. <laughs> one more, one more. What do you think? Let's bet. What do you think? It's gonna restart the game, or it's gonna kick us back to the demo? Ooh, it should kick us back to the the demos. I'm gonna say it's gonna do the game. Oh, so you can select if you wanna play the other one. <gasps> gonna, oh, is it just? Wait, no, I got one more life. Okay. <laughs> I bet it's they're gonna, being very generous. Yeah, I bet it's gonna restart the game. Oh no. Okay. Oh. Oh no. Ah, you did. You're right. You're right. Yeah. Well, I was, I was like half right. <laughs> I thought it'd be. I thought it'd restart the level. <laughs> you can't, Sam. Holy. <laughs> Is that two can't, Sam? Yeah, so. Oh, he got us aboard. Oh, so this is not a uh, this is a board level. Yeah. Yep. Anywhere to surface to slide on. I think I'm not technically everywhere. Uh, yeah, right. Oh, Klonoa, are you okay? What is happening? <laughs> Too much uh, ayahuasca. <laughs> He's a sissy. He's a sissy. It's kind of rude. But but. Whoa, did you see that flip? That was beautiful. I'm impressed. Yeah. Okay, okay. Okay, so you can't grab, but you can jump. Oh, you can grab. Oh, no, you can grab. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I totally missed that. <gasps> oh, wow, so you can't, you can still jump off of them. Yep. Yeah, that's really cool. Whoa. Yeah. Well, it pulled out for a huge ass view here. Oh, weird. <laughs> I don't think you can grab those guys. This looks really nice. Yeah, it hey, does. Can't grab those guys, you're right. I can grab this guy, though. Nice. Ooh, right. you got a coin. I grab the ape escape cookie. You can do. Daddy? You can do flips, I guess. Jump. You can. Oh, I missed it. Ah, uh, you missed the Mario Star. Uh, oh, no. 
nice. Oh. God. oh. Hold on, hold on. Yeah. What's the clock do? Um, that's a great question. Whoa, it's, he's coming at me. Oh, my God. Turned into Crash Bandicoot. Yeah, I was going to say. Like slow down, speed up. There's just no noise for them. Oh, checkpoint? Yeah, probably checkpoint. That's a good call. Oh, no, we're going this way, I guess. Okay. <laughs> oh. Oh, a checkpoint. Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, that's... Ah, uh, that's gotta be. Whoa. I dig this. The control yeah, this is... Yeah, sorry. No, go ahead. Go ahead. Sorry. Um, I was just gonna say, it looks great. Plays great. Um, it seems well made. So this, uh, this demo would help sell you on it, huh? Yeah, yeah. Actually, it made me more want to, ah, but yeah, makes me more want to play. The, the issue with stuff like that is that um, if you see, like, someone, I really try not to watch, and I don't, I watch uh, YouTube videos about games I want to cover, um, because if I do, then I'm like, I can't top this, so then I don't want to, then uh. it motivates me. <laughs> no, no, no. I can't top this. Ooh. That was cool. This is cool. This is a cool game. Yeah, that it, it's a, a, a neat sense of, uh, oh, I know what your thought process was there. I know exactly what it was. They did not do what we thought were gonna, it was going to happen. All right, when are you just coming with me? Yeah. Look at him, he's chill. Oh, he's, there's the coin. He's happy to be with us. He is. Oh. Where are you going? Nice Come grab. Back. Oh, there's a star. What does the star do? Uh, oh. Oh. <gasps> Work, oh, work. you got your checkpoint. What's the hardest game I have played? The hardest? God hand's pretty hard. Not the hardest, but <sighs> God hand's pretty hard. Look, it, it's hard, but honestly, it's only hard for... It only took me 11 and a half hours to beat, which, honestly, I don't think is that hard. Uh, it, I, I mean, I repeated fights no more than, like, f five to ten times. And while that seems like a lot, honestly... There are other games that are harder. I, you, you cut your teeth in the in the realm in the arena of um, fucking oh, what's that game? Uh, what's the Monkey Ball about Adventure? Monkey Ball, yeah, yeah, Monkey Ball. Uh, is it, isn't it the most grueling game you played? I I think so because I had to restart for I, I restarted a quest for two hours. Yeah, that's not. And then the one before that was an hour and a half. Oh. Oh. We can't oh. Can't oh leave, no, right? we're stuck. How the heck do we leave? Show you. This is a pro gamer move. Restart. Yeah. So what was that? I'm sorry. What was the hardest? Um. I don't think I've had a. I mean, I I don't know if I'd call any of them the hardest because the, I don't think the, the degrees were varying that much. I think the hardest one would have been Monster Hunter. Oh really? Though. Yeah, because it's hard for a long time. Like, after a while, you're like, dude, can you ease up a little bit? Uh, yeah, so Monkey Ball is difficult, but er early on and very late in the game were, were easy. Like, early on was, you know, growing pains, but it was really honestly easy. Right, getting used to it. Spy yeah. Hunter. Oh, Spy Hunter. Who's your favorite wrestler? Who's my favorite wrestler? I don't. I've I've barely ever watched wrestling, so what? I don't know. You don't like Dwayne <laughs> the Rock Johnson? He's in Spy Hunter. <laughs> He's in Spy. Oh, Spy Hunter. I see. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Right. Oh, okay. Now, I would say Monster Hunter for right now. I'm sure I'll play another hard game. That uh, makes me cry. Spy Hunter is an interesting. Um interesting series because it was like oh i can't you have to go down yeah test license no oh no spy hunter is an interesting series because like it had a it was like an okay arcade game and then like they kept trying to reboot it and it just sucked every time <sighs> <sighs> yeah as far as i remember because <laughs> there was 
there was this PS2 game, this one, and then they tried to do like a 361, and there was supposed to be a movie. The movie got canceled, but I think the movie was like made, wasn't it? You know, I don't know anything about the movie, so I don't know, but... Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> uh... uh... <laughs> very low settings for streaming. <laughs> streaming uh, in objects. I'm going to tell my kids this was Inception. This is literally where a loading screen would normally be. <laughs> I want to hit X, but I don't want to hit X. I want to, like, let it play out. Oh, I can't hit X. doesn't do anything. Okay, you guys are getting <laughs> the, You guys are seeing how the sausage is made. Yeah. And now things are loading in. We can't even oh. see. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. Yes. Do I like strategy war games? Uh, sure, yeah, yeah. Um, are you talking about like, you know, I mean, not risk, but like risk, you know, like it's a strategy war game. Um, I I, I played uh, Excellent. I played Crusader Kings two and uh, Europa Universalis four. Excellent. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> Not a button does anything. All right, well that's why Hunter. <laughs> <laughs> it might be the it because it's uh you know, emulator. Yeah, I think so. All right, I have a good feeling about the next game. Don't you worry. I'm, I'm glad you do. I like um there was a game Warzone 2100 on the PlayStation. It's a really good strategy, RTS game. Is it really? You can up. Uh... Mm. Oh, sorry, you can, um, oh god, it's already one. Um, you can customize your units. So if you want, like, a tank Ooh. that has, like, a flamethrower on it, you put a flamethrower on it. If you want, like, a machine gun, you put a machine gun. It was cool because it was on the PlayStation, which isn't really known for RTS games. Other than, yeah, uh, uh, except for, uh, Command and Conquer. Yeah, so I guess it had the best RTS on it. It did. Drakken! Demo? Yeah! Video. What do you think? Uh, I'm gonna say video. I think you're right. Damn it! I mean, I didn't want it to be, but I had this feeling. Yeah. It looks too fun to be on on the demo disc. True, true. This is actually a game I want to play soon. I think it would make a really good video. Yeah, yeah. Please, I want to watch it. <laughs> I want to see what you do. I played um I played Enclave, which is a really weird game on Xbox and PC. And I yeah. Have the footage. Oh, you know that game? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I um I want to make a video on that really bad. That'll be soon. Do it. It's such a weird game. There was like an HD remake they were doing, but then like they 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 were uh, marketing for it and then they stopped and then it, like it was delayed and it was like so hard getting info on it. It was like it was such a mess. Oh. Look like I don't know like what they're doing. Ah, uh, that's sad. I don't even know if it came out. The HD version. <laughs> oh, <you're pretty> <laughs> oh my god. Isn't this your favorite game? No, this is Seven Sorrows. This is uh, Dark Legacy. Uh, Age of History 2 is a simpler version of Crusader Kings. Oh. Yeah, yeah. I uh I, I would I would try something like that. I, I liked uh I liked Crusader Kings. It was hard. I never got Okay, I'm Jake. Oh god. Oh, they have some characters. Oh, um, that's kind of boring. They got busty sor sorceress. I was gonna say wizard, uh, jester, <laughs> dwarf, and then just a knight. Kind of boring. Yeah. Oh, Interesting. Ooh, they got the yeah. The yellow. It's like the arcade. That's cool. Oh wow. Realm is open for you to explore. Look for the glowing portal. Yes. Um. Honestly, the seven. I'm gonna have to replay Seven Sorrows for. Uh, I'm gonna make a new. I'm gonna make a new video on it uh, later on. Uh, but uh, I'll eventually play through it again. It's not. It's not. It's. It's repetitive. It's the same thing over and over. That's it. This game. I have a feeling it's not the greatest. What are you talking about? This looks. This is great. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not reading that, bro. 
I can like run like a zombie for a minute. Sometimes L1 <laughs> does the zombie run, sometimes it doesn't. It doesn't know what it wants to do. Oh, it's like sprinting with a bar in the bottom. Oh, oh, I see it. I see it. Yeah, it's like a sprint button. It's a block. So you have to defeat each of these portals, I assume? Yeah, I got the hand on the hip. Very sassy. Very sassy. <laughs> Theo. Poison. What a weird first spell. Yeah. I got the... what, is, what is she doing? <laughs> I don't know what that is. Maybe it's... Uh... Is there, is there a way to look at your controls? Because I know it showed earlier, but... Yeah, you gotta talk to the goober back here. <laughs> Wait, why isn't it letting you select a level? Do you have to do right here? Doing anything I can not to talk to that guy. Oh, there it is. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, don't talk to him. <laughs> See you, nerd. You are now entering the poison fields. Bro, I, I like this oh, announcer ooh. a lot. Unironically. <laughs> fields. Oh yeah, this is this is really faithful to the original. Yeah, I was gonna say it seems. This seems a million times better than the would you than the one you played. Seven Sorrows, yeah, yeah. This, I mean, like you know, I, I don't want anything more than a classic Gauntlet game. I, I it honestly should be you know like this. So that other one would just felt weird. Yeah, you know what this reminds me of? You ever play um? Ninja Ninja Darkness? Darkness Ninja? What's Nin it called? On PlayStation. Oh. You are no. purple ninja. It's kind of like isometric. And oh, yes! 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 Uh, <laughs> I know what you're talking about. Everyone played that game, but no one remembers the name of it. It's no! Like, it's one of those games. Yeah, I like. I want to try, try that game again. Gosh. Um. It was like Ninja, ninja Darkness, Darkness Ninja. Some Darkness Ninja. <laughs> Let's see. That game was hard, I remember. Uh, Shadow of Darkness. Ah, damn it, there's no ninja in there. Okay. Yep, yep, Shadow of Darkness. Yep, yeah, it looks just like what you're, what this game looks like. I'm not even kidding. It had, um, had that, it definitely looked like a PlayStation game. This, this looks like a PlayStation game, not PS2, really. It does, yeah, I was gonna say something, but I didn't want to. <laughs> I had this feeling. You need your bad, I'm your bad cop. A bad, slightly bad cop, slightly good cop. Or, or <laughs> slightly good cop. Dang. Oh. Okay. Oh, you use the magic. Whoa. Yeah, we got screen clears. That's cool. Oh my god. Don't step on that. Ooh, you can summon summon skellies. Oh. What exactly the why does the screen look like puke right now? There's just stuff all over it. Yeah, it's 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 a mood. Oh my god. god this, is, this is the dark souls of you. Well what are you calling <laughs> out of block? <laughs> I did. told you. <laughs> Play better. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what the block. Why would you have that tooltip and not the tooltip that just tells me what the block is? Okay, I, I love the little thing at the bottom that said fruit. Yeah. <laughs> Brought up a picture of fruit. I think it's it's like the original. Ooh, bananas. Oh, he's a general. This yeah, you had to find a rune stone and what else? Oh, you're paying way more attention than I am. <laughs> uh, no, I just remember from the N64 version. Uh oh. <laughs> just on. dancing for yeah, him. You, you kill me, I'm gonna do do little hip sways. <laughs> oh, these noises are exactly the same as the other games too. It's so weird. Yeah, this is actually not not terrible. It goes so go so fast that I don't have a my brain doesn't have a chance to get bored <laughs> yeah it's like it's like sur subway surfers just constant and the subway oh, surfers God. are just like constant stimulation <laughs> look, look at the keys look at the keys Ugh. oh the dead body like, if you just run at them she melees it's kind of cool oh I guess it's a special thing for the little or no, she melees them too, huh? Yeah, I'm just, I'm not hitting anything. I'm just moving. I guess that you did in the original, don't you? I don't know. Maybe it's so that you don't get stuck. Like, you know, if you're moving and you and you don't press any buttons, it's so you don't just stand there doing nothing. Yeah. <laughs> I 
didn't know she said it like that. Mmm, very delicious. Eat another one. Yeah. Give me those crystals. All right, I think I've, I think I've seen the other. Yeah, this is pretty much. Okay, just, just I can't, Joe. I can't stop playing. Oh no, Joe, we've lost. We've lost him to the demo of. <laughs> Joe, there's a, there's a thing down there, Joe. What if I just. Oh yeah. What if I just. What if I just get down there? No, we bought. We bought. We bought Gauntlet. And I'm playing Gauntlet. <laughs> I had an Amazon. I'm line. watching him play Gauntlet. <laughs> Joe, we haven't played it traps. together. Joe, he he has he has, he has me trapped in a little. Uh, yeah. A little uh, black mirror type device. Oh, I was thinking of saw. He has me trapped in a saw device. I have a saw. I I can either watch him play or I can saw my own leg off. I got halfway through and I decided I'll just watch him. I got the chest, Joe. You did it! No, I don't have a, I don't have a key for the chest. Oh, you don't have a key? I don't have a key. What, what are those? Golden, Golden icon. icon. I don't know. They're just giving me crap. All right, I saw what there is to see. That's not, that's not, that's not, that could be worse. That could be worse. Yeah. There we go. It, w was it better than? Was it better than Primal? What, portal. <laughs> portal <Primal>? Runner. <laughs> primal. Primal. It, it, it is better than Far Cry Primal. <laughs> Ooh, super bomb bad racing. Is it? Is it? Is it a bomb? Bomb ad or is it bomb bad? I think it's supposed to be bomb bad. What does that mean? Uh... Does that have a meaning? Oh, no, it's tail of the sunny all, all over again. Uh, well, just a simple Google search does not have anything. I'm gonna be Jar Jar. Uh, oh, oh, oh! It's the word for superior or superb in Gungan Basic, like literally the Gungan language. Excuse you? There you what? go. <laughs> That's it. That's bomb bad means superior or superb in the Gungan language. So it's an actual in in game lore appropriate word. So the game is called Super Superior. Yeah. I can't. I can't be Charger. <gasps> be Darth Maul. No, he's. <laughs> he's gonna be Yada. You can only play Dune C. I love Dune C. Let's go. <sighs> Joe, Speed I can't boost. Do a, I can't do a Yoda impression. Um. Please, Joe. I, I, I would if I wasn't. <laughs> uh. If you weren't sick. Maybe. Load <laughs> <laughs> the game. Pick up gadgets. You must. Oh. God. <laughs> okay. You did it. It's more than I did. <laughs> Jawas! Oh my god, I love Jawas. They're like in the Mandalorian. Oh my god, they made a game based on that. It's crazy. Oh yeah, that's right. Yeah, they made a game based on Mandalorian. So yeah, this is just a silly razor. Oh my. Why does it make skid noises? Wow. This is a lot. This just seems jarring. It is jarring. My brain is jumbled. <laughs> You're in third. You're in third. Somehow you got in third already. There's a horn noise that sounds just like a car. It sounds like a 2005 Honda Civic. I don't know why it sounds like that. Okay, you got an item. I don't know how to, what to press for it. I like how his ears flap. Oh, oh, I'm doing a thing. Oh, you're... <laughs> you've got, like, some electric pee. This is a. This is. This is awful. Yeah, this doesn't look that great. What? I thought this was supposed to be fun. No, this is not. This is the opposite. <laughs> this control. This control is so bad. What is that you're getting? Are those boosts? I. You're asking questions, Joe. Oh, I got a gun now. Oh. These, these sound like free stock sound effects. Don't cross streams. 
Do you have a turbo? Uh, I don't know. I'm trying. Joe, I'm trying. I know it doesn't look like it, but I am trying. <laughs> Sometimes, oh, that, Lord. sometimes R1 works and does a thing, sometimes it doesn't. I think it's connected to items, but sometimes the items just don't work. This is a uh, yeah, I, I don't know if it knows you have an item sometimes. No, it's fuck me, I guess. Oh. Did someone set something on that wall that zaps you every time you go past it? I, yeah, that's actually probably what happened. Oh, you can shoot by behind me. I can't tell what they're saying to each other because the audio is mixed so poorly. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I got my cane. Oh yeah, you were like trying to touch the the top of the rocks. Yeah. So you can like you can angle up and down a little bit. But why? <laughs> yeah, it gives it like a weird kind of floatiness. You know, it reminds me of Freaky Flyers, but I remember that game actually being decent. <laughs> oh, oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, no. His face. <laughs> <laughs> Yoda, what did they do to you? <laughs> Jesus. Oh, that's going to give me nightmares. <laughs> I kind of want to see it again. I don't. No, don't do it to me. Uh, That's it. Oh, God. Oh, Lord. What? Oh, no. It moves. He looks like... He looks like... Oh, it's going to be... Oh, it's gonna be he looks like the uh, gremlin goblin. He looks like the um, goblins from Harry Potter. Oh, uh, yeah, like Dobby. No, well... To say the Jew goblins. <laughs> oh, I see. <laughs> from, from Harry Potter, it's a little, it's a little spicy. Eight characters, a bunch of tracks, a bunch of power ups, and <laughs> shitty no, gameplay. Yeah, that is that is horrible. That is not. Sad day. I thought it'd be fun. I know. I thought it would be too. I thought it'd be like um Star Wars Demolition. I think it's called. So yeah, something like that. This has got to be a video, right? Oh. No, this is, um, gameplay. It should be near the end, too. I think we're just about tail end. I think so, game. probably. Eidos Interactive. Uh, Crystal. Doing Tomb Raider. Like yep. Crazy. Tomb Raider. Uh, these games. And, uh, uh, Freedom Fighters. Did they really? They do no, no, because that was Hitman and stuff was not. It was same. It was IDOS, but it wasn't the same devs. It's a work in progress. Thank you. Apparently, the people love these games. Raziel emerges from the Chronoplast time portal and returns to different eras of Noskos past in his relentless pursuit of Cain. Over the course of his journey, he unearths the mysteries of Noskos ancient races and exposes the secrets behind the corruption of the pillars and the vampire genocide. Ah, uh, yeah, so Reaver 2. Ooh, offer up a sacrifice to the god statue. Use the dark and light Reavers to discover the still beating heart. That's it? Return the heart to its rightful place. Oh, okay. Remember, the dark Reaver can blind as well as create bridges from the shadows. Use the spectral realm to your advantage. It's a lot of that, text. Yeah, it is. That, that, that's an interesting power. You can either blind people or create bridges. What? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I remember playing the demo for this on PS1. I'm not, not Soul Reaver 2, but Soul Reaver. Soul Reaver was a PS1 game that wasn't it. That's right. Uh-huh. Was it good? Uh, I only ever played the demo. Was the demo good? <laughs> it was. It was fun. Yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah, people yeah, love you... these Legacy Kane. Yeah. Oh yeah, they yeah, they do. I know that. Oh yeah, this looks like it controls just the same. Yet when you kill an enemy, their soul comes up, and you can open up your mouth or your your cloth to like suck it in. Okay. But you have to like push and hold the button to do it. I think. Select menu. Oh, you have different powers. Okay, okay, okay. Nice. 
Um, production value is already miles ahead. The other games we checked out. Oh yeah. You can just, it's weird. You can like tell quality, you know, I mean, just by like the way it looks and feels when you start playing. Yeah. They didn't take the time to figure out how characters move. Yeah. That's a side of a bad game. Portal Runner. Ugh. Uh, Auto face R1. Next to dodge. Well, that's cool. Oh, yeah, good deal. Yeah, that has like really. It like looks like you're actually dodging too. It's... Oh, I got his. Uh, I got his little trident. Page yeah, you did. Hold circle. I'm feeding. Okay. Feed on his soul. Yeah. Yum yum. See, he's holding open. He's like, yeah, yummy. I'm a vampire turned into a vampire by Kane. That's all I know about the series. And that the first game was an isometric game. Oh yeah. I saw that they recently figured out a secret in that in that very first game. Oh. Um Oh. Oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, there was a ship that you could get to that no one knew how to get to, and uh, there was an interview where the guy actually said that there's four switches around the world that you find, and they found it. They found a way to get to the ship, uh, like, recently. That's cool that um, old secrets are still being found. Yeah, yeah, uh, Oddhead. Oddheader found it. Who's that? He does a lot of uh, those video game-type mysteries. Oh, um, he... Yeah, he's the one who uh, uh, made it a lot more uh, popular, the the uh, the Futurama Easter egg. Oh, okay. Yeah, it was like it took four four years or so for someone to figure out how to activate the Easter egg, but they did it. And be with the light. Oh, that's Square. Easy. Oops. Uh, I want Soul Reaver, which I think is. Uh, no. Whoa. With Reaver on, but it doesn't give a name, so I don't know. I don't know which is Reaver. This. That try that one. It's not letting me this time. Like, oh no. You might have run out of. Uh... Yeah, I can't move. And I can't do anything. Oh. Okay. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Huh. So you can run out. I wonder if you gotta. Oh, step into that. Nothing. Nothing. There's gotta be a. Nope. Um. Maybe if I step into. Oh, soul. Yeah. There it is. Yeah. Maybe it takes a soul to. Oh, well, no, it's still grayed out. Stand the swirling point. This is actually. I do like the tooltips a lot. It's like, hey, dummy. This how you. Oh, there you go. Yep. I'm like shifting. Oh, because. Yeah, you're shifting the world. There you go. There you go. And then you viewed with light. I guess I don't need to. I guess right now you don't need to, yeah. I don't think I need that. How do I... Okay, we got the darkness over here. Put the light in the darkness. I like yeah. how he runs. With his hands, like, kind of waving. Yeah, like I'm wading through water. It's an allegory oh. for his uh, journey. <laughs> I wish there was music. I wonder. I wonder if there. No, it's a DVD. Well, no. Yeah, I guess it would be a DVD. I was gonna say some early PS2 games were on CDs still, but. Oh, um, were they really? Yeah, because I'm thinking. Yeah, if they had a black bottom, they were a CD. It would. It would say on the on the art as well it would say cd wrong oh i see i see um i was just thinking if this had enough space for the music on the disc itself but it... oh maybe it doesn't yeah because it does feel barren there is music but it's it's very atmospheric there must be a way to yeah they i i imagine the real game explains things a little bit better I'm... Yeah, this is more like just push some buttons and see how you feel about it. Yeah, they did not put a ton of effort into. You may need an item from later on too, or or just switch in the green world thing. Yeah, true. Oh, it it changes the physical environment around you. That's cool. Um, what do you 
feel and go back? Sure, yeah. yeah. We're just kind of checking things out slowly. It seems um, but yeah, this is... When you switch, you can't, um, you can't switch back. I guess unless you go to the portal. I think. We don't have a Soul Reaver expert in chat. <laughs> All over. It's just a... Wait a minute. Oh, no. Does he... I feel like he jumps higher in this mode. He might. All right, let's go to the portal. Oh, wait, can I? Soul. No. Okay, okay. Portal, swap back. Yay. Now, hold on. Can, can you select that one again and do the Soul River thing? Yeah, that one. Ooh. Now, now try the light. Yeah, now you now have the light reaver. Might go back down. Or see if maybe that. Yep, dark. Dark reaver. Press X to oh, pick up. So I can switch light and dark. Oh, it has the things on the wall telling you as well. So I wonder if I can use the dark on this thing down here. Oh, maybe, yeah, because it has the symbols there. It's a little slow running. It's, it's interesting when you play old games like this because it, it just it took forever to do anything. Time yeah, time. movement options were definitely not something. I think I, I wonder if, too, like, partly it was based on the fact that things had to load. Like, that hallway right there doesn't necessarily need to be that long unless it's uh, loading. You're right. It's either loading or it's... um. A physical part of the level, and they and they have to have the space for it. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, it, it's interesting because you play these old games, and it's um, there's such a different. X to climb, climb where, climb what? Um, it's such a different. The time wasn't. Everything was slower. <gasps> you know what I'm saying. Oh. You know what I mean? Like, especially when you're a kid, obviously. Yeah. But it, it was just, you didn't mind that a hallway took so long. But now, as an adult, it's like, it's like, geez, I got, I got things to do. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hallway. This hallway needs to finish. You might need to go to the, one of the other walls. Yeah. There's doors know. like that one. Yeah. Ooh. Nice. I don't want to, I want to get into some combat. I want to, I want to see what this game's actually about. Or I guess we did combat, but yeah. Okay, he is not. Ooh, I nice. This knights were better. <laughs> better. A better fight. Yeah. Okay, so that. So it's a puzzle action adventure, I'm assuming. I think so. With a heavy emphasis on, on story, I'm hoping, I'm assuming. That's what everyone seems to like about it. Yeah, I, th I think so. Yeah, it's got a lot, a decent amount of story with it. Yeah, the combat was. Ooh. Oh, dang. Oh. My sword's about dead. Or is that like a special ability? Oh, no. I didn't mean to. Uh oh. I didn't mean to go into the upside down. Oh, no. <laughs> the frogs from Resident Evil. Oh, never mind. They're gone. It's. I guess you can go through the cutscene in the green world. Yeah, it's it's interesting how it seems to be okay with you swapping back and forth, and it has substantial changes. Yeah, yeah, it literally puts you in a different world. Like the the monster you're fighting is just gone. Yeah, so it's like um, two games in one. Ooh. Don't give them ideas. No, I think the. Hold L2 and X to climb the pillar. I'm trying. Why, why L2? Oh, literally oh. to like jump all the way up it. Yeah, oh. it's like a, you can jump higher. That's really cool. You can <gasps> jump and then you can. That's cool. We cannot. Uh oh. Not. Okay, well. Guess we don't need to. I thought that's where you switched back to that world. Yeah, me too. You know, Joe, sometimes life throws you a curveball. <laughs> okay, now what about that 
the bridge making. I oh, oh, the about. light. The light went over there. There's a light and dark uh, uh, things you can uh, swap at once you can get to them. Yeah. Do I want light or dark? I think you might need to do both to get across. I'm not sure. I don't know. I can be your angel or your demon. Okay, that was a bad fall. <laughs> <laughs> They're on you. Does killing these guys do anything for me? I don't think so. I don't think they drop souls or anything. Yeah. Is this just a weapon? Oh, God. It looks like it. Okay, get back up here. Go to the light. Frogger jump. Why does my guy remind me of a frog? I think because his big hands and feet. Oh, you can't do it because you're not the reaver yeah. mode. Light reaver. But you can't get back to it. Oh, there you oh. go. Oh, sorry. Yeah, square. I'm light reaver. I need to be dark reaver. <laughs> no, I don't want to. I don't want to fight. Stop it. Smack you. Oh, oh, dang. Oh, that was a, nice. That was, a, that was a Kratos move. Yeah. Okay, now that I now you got to switch back to the Reaver. This one? Yeah. Yep. Because I killed the dude. Now I can be the Light Reaver. And then I can become the Dark Reaver. Is that going to push me off? I bet it does. No. Nice. Wait, can I? No. Let's see. Can I pull that? Well, where, where do we put these things? Uh... I don't think I wanted that. Did you push a button? No, he just automatically did it. Huh. Oh, oh, hey, hey. Can yeah. you pull that thing? This thing? Yeah. Like, the handle's on it. Can you pull it? I think so. Uh, it could just be, like, it could just be decoration stuff. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think I can. It'd be an awkward angle to pull it, too. You're right. Hold on, hold on, I'm big, I'm thinking, oh, I can, oh, God. <laughs> what? <laughs> hold on. Right. You just sucked him right in. Yeah. Okay, how do I, that light, or those eyes, I mean. Mm. It's dark now, see how it's dark over there? Oh, yeah, go up, go to spectral. To get up to ledges. Oh, so spectral is how you get up ledges. Well, well, wait a minute. Oh, yeah, the eye's looking at you. Yeah. Can I? I can't jump that, can I? No. No, there's no way. So, yeah, the eye automatically changes me. Huh? It's nothing. What if I go on this other side? Oh, yeah, see if there's any. Oh, where does this go? Oh, that's a... No, I came from the bottom. Well, wait, there's no eye there. Yeah. You're right. Uh, So, well, the only way to know what that what sword we need is to, I think, change back and see what the color that is, right? I think so. You have to go to your... The, the portal thing. Yeah. Portal. Change. And then, oh, to operate. To operate? Okay. <gasps> oh. Now, that gate, uh, that gate is probably switched. Or that. Wait way. a minute. Wait a minute. If you if you jump and glide with that thing pushing you, does it glide you across? That's a that's a that's a that's a big thinking. Uh, yeah. Wow. Okay. So maybe you need the light. So now I dark right, so reaver. Wait, no, that'll Yep. Correct. Now I, I think yeah uh Well, the only problem is that you need to glide across. We don't know what it is you need, but it looks like it's it is dark. Yeah, if I go But the problem is that this eye, so you're gonna have to like pull this down and glide across. Yeah, which but if you do that, I wonder Oh, do you have to put it away? I don't think you can. Hey, what's up? Welcome. We're just uh, finishing up this. Uh, uh oh. I'm in the We're just finishing up this demo disc. Can oh, you grab it from here? Or no. 
Hey, Dark Blade. Dark Blade! Yeah, yeah, this uh, demo disc has Soul Reaver. So I think I could turn. Legacy of Kane. I think I'm. I think I'm gonna call it. <laughs> oh, that's fine. That's fine. We're just looking at the demos. You're 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 welcome to to, to quit out and go uh, to the next one. We've been doing this for two and a half hours, so. That's true. But then you phrase it like that, and then I don't want to. <laughs> you, can, you can be a little baby, baby. You know, baby quit. Quit because you're a baby, you know, it's whatever. You can't even beat a demo, it's fine, you know. I mean, it's just a demo. <laughs> You'd think someone could complete a demo, but you know, it's, you know just don't, don't worry about it. <laughs> well, I was wondering why we were reacting. Oh, no, we just were having a good time. Uh, it, it, it's it's a fun, it's fun to be able to cover things that we don't normally cover. Like, I'm not gonna make a video, Tuna is, um, but you know, just have, have a good time. That's why I asked in the beginning, oh, yeah, 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 it's just fun. To ask if I wanted to do this with them, and I said yes. Yeah, see what um, see what it was like in two thousand one. Way sweet, back in the day. Sweet sweet candy. Oh. That's your quote for the game. What a what a what a weird preview, to write. Yeah, it said there are only three words in the English language that can describe the game, and it was. Isn't that? Isn't that sweet isn't that, sweet candy? Isn't that two words? That's technically two. That's it's three words total. Oh, that's it. <laughs> that's it. We got. Yeah, we did it. That's it. All right. Well. Yeah, we got. Wait, we wait. have looked at everything in the demo disc. Yeah. Uh, this is. We saw hmm. some. We saw some videos. We got the panda costume for Oni Musha. We didn't complete a single demo. I think. <laughs> um. Yeah. Yeah. Technically, the 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 right the racing one. Um. Yeah. In la last place. Fourth place. Yeah. I mean, completed. Like, what do you mean, though? You you did get to the end of it. It sent you back to the menu. <laughs> <laughs> That's okay, because we got the panda bear costume and Onimushi. Are you, did you play Onimushi yet? If I have not. You didn't. I didn't think you did. You should. I know. I know. I don't know. If, I don't think I have it yet. I need to buy it. It's a good game. That is demo disc. Number one, Joe. Number one of uh, PlayStation Magazine, and we have a lot more to look at. Yeah, hopefully so. more um, finishable games on the demos would be nice. Maybe <laughs> oh, yeah. some nice separation between what's a video and what's an actual demo would be nice. You know, instead of just, you know, they, they, they say demo, it's the vault. And then you get in there and you're like, oh, I'm going to play some games. It's, then you got a video. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, not, yeah. it's not the best. It's not the best. I'm going to say it. it's not the best. <laughs> Yeah, the demos were very, very, uh, and this, this disc here were, I, 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 except for Klonoa and, you know, uh, How dare you? Gauntlet was pretty good. How dare you speak ill of Super Bomb Bad Racing? Super Superior Racing. <laughs> yeah, the, the, it's really interesting. And Legacy Kane. The type of games they picked are bad, for the most part, for the first demo, you know? It's the, it's the big E3 edition. you think it would be like... Metal Gear 2. Yeah. They had, they had videos of it. Yeah, yeah, they had they had videos. Even this, they could have had a demo of that, but... Yeah, and you would think, um, too, with the the games on here that I actually would want to play a demo of aren't, are just videos. You know, Draken, I would want to play a thing of. Yeah. Um, Okage. Just Okage. Yeah. Yeah, that's a shame. What a, what a crappy demo. Yeah, sad, sad, uh, sad was, demo disc. It was interesting. It was, it was fun to see. Um, and that's going to do it. Thanks so much for watching. Sweet. All right, well, guys, um, oh, uh, everyone's doing okay now. We're, we're feeling better, Dark Blade. We're feeling better. It's, it's... Are you going to, are you going to, um, do, um... The Warriors have um, Star, um, not Star Wars. The lives of the Final Dark. Fantasy. No, no, it's, it's late, and I am... Tired, so. Oh yes. Big O, that was the name. Big O. Big O, there you go. Yeah, it just came to me. He did the punch thing, and then he and then he put his hands together, his knuckles, and, he, and then like he powered up. Oh. I didn't like it. I didn't like it.
Yeah, Dragon Ball was good, of course. Oh yeah. I remember liking Outlaw Star. I don't remember why. Hunter Hunter was Hunter Hunter was never on. Um, Yu Yu Hakusho was good. I haven't seen that. Yu Yu Hakusho was good. Let's check it out. It's funny. I went into um, they do the finger gun thing. You know, yeah. Like his power. I was in, I was going to the class one day, in Japanese class here in school, and uh, the teacher was doing it with the kids. It was such a weird <laughs> callback. I was like, yeah. I was like, you guys know you Hakusho? show? <laughs> nice. Dark played Lowe's Big O. Oh really? I remember. I don't remember anything about it other than the fist thing. They and that's like it powers up, and uh, and uh, I didn't care for it. I don't remember why. Just not. Uh... Not as interesting. Yeah, I think I, I like uh, Gundam was more interesting. I felt like I think it was more actiony. Bigo was, Bigo had like I think it had like one fight, an episode, and it was like it was at the end, and then he just when he does the fist thing, that's like his I'm gonna end this moment. <laughs> but, at least you knew when. Yeah. <laughs> All right, everyone. I'm gonna be done with the stream. I'm getting tired, and uh, uh, I will be back on tomorrow with Final Fantasy X, and then we'll we'll be back together to do more uh, demo discs at some point. Yeah, that was but really for fun. now. Yeah, yeah, it was. It was a lot of fun. Uh, so have a good night, everyone. I'll see everyone tomorrow for Final Fantasy uh, X because yep. that's what it has to say on the thing. <laughs> see you guys. Thank you so much for some bite. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye.